Okay, we're on. Hello. There we go. Hello, everybody. We got very, very, very special guest today, Wes Johnson. Hello, guys. This is my real voice. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> this is already. This is already my favorite. This is my favorite stream we've had by far already. It only just started. Welcome to all of our new viewers. Turn up your Discord uh, audio a little bit. Discord audio. Cool. Yeah. Um, yeah, why don't you tell us, uh, once you're done with that, tell us what, what we're going to be doing today in, in the land of Skyrim. Yeah, Abby, we're working on that. Yeah, right. yeah. Sorry, technical difficulties. Sorry. Let me... Uh, test, test, test it. Is this on? It should be. It, it's uh, it's my fault for being so quiet. Let me... Uh, I was joking. I was if just... you, <laughs> if, you can go into your Discord and uh, just increase our volume individually that way i think i've maxed out wes um oh, how's no. this is this any better chat is it the the problem with twitch is since it's all live you can't test it before you can't it. effectively <laughs> test audio level yeah let me know well, if this is better guys just fine okay you're definitely sounding better in my ear okay that's way better that's, that's better. way better yep. okay Perfect. So yeah, what what are we going to be doing today in Skyrim? Let's we are going to be doing. Thank you, Vigo. Um, Thank you for following, by the way. Three Everyone quests followed before stream. Thank you so much. Yeah. Oh yeah, I should. Vigo, Insane Pixels, Kitty Mama, Knowing Divine, Riley Grace Roshong. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Um, we have a special guest on stream. Ah, uh, hello, dear child. Of there he is. Jeez, wow, I... look at that. <laughs> this is. I'm so happy. Loves you. Yeah. So we're going to be doing three quests today, chat. We're going to be doing, uh, in, in case you can't tell by the boat uh, docked in the harbor here, we're going to be assassinating the emperor of, of um, Tampriel, and then we're going to be... True? Yeah, I think that qualifies. Yeah, I think so. Uh, and yeah, we got one Wes who's going to help out. So, um, and another Wes who we're going to be killing. And yeah. So we're, we're going to start off by killing our guest, basically chat. <laughs> um, now, and then be able to hear the dialogue in the game. Because hopefully not, I can just repeatedly say, have you heard the tale of Matthew Bellamont? <laughs> you know, uh, Twitch will be able to hear the game audio. Uh, we probably won't since we're getting it streamed to us from discord. Yeah. But yeah. Um, we'll be there, but please feel free to uh, embellish and, and add anything on. Yeah, we're on accompanied, side, we're by, accompanied our by our guests. Yeah, exactly. We're accompanied by our guests, and we're going to kill our guests. It's it's a great time. Great, grand old time. Uh, but after we kill the Emperor, uh, we are going to visit uh, good old Sheogoreth. Classic. Uh, oh, wonderful. Pleasure. Yeah, <laughs> so great. And then finally, we're going to wrap it up by uh, visiting uh, Hermaeus Mora. Um, so... Hermaeus Mora has all the knowledge you need, although you did not know you needed it. I'm so happy. I love this. <laughs> Me too. This is so great. <laughs> um, we're going to have to get a little sneaky here. Um, we're going to be now, boarding the ship. this is going to get your spectral assassin all wet. They're going to have to hang him out to dry. It's gonna be <laughs> yeah. Oh, he, look at him. He's just kind of He's just kind of staying oh, back there, actually. He's chilling. He's yeah, scared. He'll wait. <laughs> walk across the water and evaporate into the ship once you're there. Because, you know, frankly, have you ever smelled wet dog? That's what a wet spectral assassin wet spectral. sounds like. You know what? I it's good to know. It, and I have smelled wet dog. Yeah. Okay, I think we can uh, go ahead and sneak up in, in here. Yeah, come on. Wow. How many... Wes, how many old lines do you know off the top of your head? I've already given them to you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, there's your answer, chat. He is alleged. Oh, okay. We've so, already we've already so, been caught. We're so oh. blessed that he's here with us. You got him, Wes. Good job. My blade thirst blood. <laughs> this is surreal. I can't tell who's talking. Is it like actually the <laughs> is it Wes or is it Lucian Lachance? So it's still spooky. There we go. I don't know if anybody else has seen this, but I recently saw I real life a video that. of a uh, a streamer who was playing Skyrim and uh, he was doing this quest. 
and he gets to the Emperor, <laughs> and the oh. Emperor, you know, gives his speech about, well, such is the way of assassins and emperors, and, you know, basically, I get that you're here to kill me, so, uh, and he... see your way to do it. Small thing. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Right. Uh, oh, yeah. He... He gets to it and he goes, you know what? I, I feel like this should be a, a big moment. This should be a ceremonious moment. And he and he uh, he puts away all his weapons and he, he dresses he, up as a chef. He does the kill like barehanded, but <laughs> he gets the the suplex kill animation <laughs> where he like flips the emperor over. <laughs> it, wow. It was <laughs> it was so funny. I, how, I can't how do you feel about being uh, kind of dishonored like that, Wes? Uh, I don't like it when people flip me upside down. Man. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I, it happens to me all the time. Like Mark does it to me on a daily basis. Yeah, that's true. I, I really, I really go hard with uh, the bullying my brother thing. Yeah. How long will it take me to pick this master lock, I know, Chad? I wasn't gonna comment. You uh, I've got twenty six <laughs> left, so right, well. I, I'll, I'll definitely get it. Well, take your time with it. Don't, don't rush. <laughs> all right. It's all in the touch. Don't don't worry that we're all here and oh. judging. Just <laughs> everybody's watching you. A little to the left, yeah, someone the said. Left. All right. Listen to chat. Chat knows how to play this game better than I do. I know. <laughs> yes, yes. Thank you, and good luck with your homework. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. There we go. <laughs> there you got, go. got it. Nicely done. Oh, got it. <laughs> Should we speak oh, to a uh, constant Mr. Show? Don't apologize for pestering. What tweaking are you? What uh, do you think? I've been expecting that. I'm going to use my line for more wind. You are from the Dark Brotherhood. I too. You have to come this far just to stand. So you, you are here to kill me, and I won't stop you. But a few requests before you do. First, do you have any snack pack pudding? <laughs> I can use a little chocolate pudding before I go. Secondly, I can like rev Lucy and Lachance. Big fan, Lucy. And I, a big fan of you as well. All right, enough of this self serving dialogue. Who are you? You want to kill me? Well, I want you to do me a favor. Someone has ordered this, and I want you to go back and dispatch them with extreme haste. Would you do me this small favor? Wow, that was beautiful. I'm so happy. I don't think we could say no to that. Yeah. Uh, we're definitely, yes, I mean, so we always say yes to the Emperor, of course. Yeah, I, al I, I always kill him by my tear. I don't like Stefan, yes. are you seeing? I am seeing that. Um, thanks for the heads up. I will turn up the chat when, uh, the chat volume then. Part of um, what we're going to do as this quest is we're going to kill Amon, right? Well. <laughs> like on stream with that's us. Kind of, we're, that's that's going to happen, right? Yeah, it, uh, the stream didn't just freeze chat. Are you, chat. are you going to are you going to flip them? Are you going to uh, put them in suplex? Uh, I, I was going to leave it up to you. Um, oh yeah, 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 that's a good question. Why don't you let Lucy do it? I'd love to see Lucy and uh, you know, a little light set, a little West on West violence there. Okay, yeah, we can we can we can we can ask Lucy if he wants to do it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, Chad, is that any better? L l let me know. Um, louder now. Am I louder? <laughs> we'll, we'll listen to him. You will kill him. So uh, you finally found him. You had to go through the whole thing as the chef and the, yeah. the imposter and the whole thing. And now here you are on a ship and he's just waiting for you here. He's just he's staring at you. What do you think of him being so resigned about this? I know. He's old and he's amazed that he was emperor for this long. I, I've nobody's seen it. Old, nobody's old and thinking, I want to die. Everybody in his heart, even the Emperor, still thinks he's 18 years old. Yeah. His knees just go. You know, the knees right. maybe not so great. But everything else, <laughs> nobody says, you know what? It's a beautiful night. The stars are out. I could go for having my throat slit. No, nobody ever says that. I, so I think. What's behind him being so peaceful about this? Maybe he knew there was like a traitor, and he's trying to basically root out corruption by getting you to kill him. I I I, I don't know. Sorts of conspiracy theories out there. I don't yeah. describe any of them really, but it's fun to read it. Some people think he's the one who actually set it up himself. 
so that he could become a martyr, that he wasn't a great emperor, and that by becoming a uh-huh. martyr, then his will gets done throughout the land. I right. I can believe that. That's that's yeah. That's that's interesting because that that sort of makes sense because like the whole dominion issue. Well, he's standing up now. Standing up. All right. Um, I think so. Lu- Lucian isn't here. Um, Lucian, summon him. All right. I'm I think. Bad at you. <laughs> Where is he? Um, I might have to wait like uh, twenty four hours. I can't wait in this location. Lucian, I think. Oh, this is so sad. Uh, he, I think he's still on the beach. Well, what? <laughs> no, he was in the ship. He might have gotten killed. Oh, was he? he into the ship for sure, yeah. I get, oh, yeah, because he was. You can summon him again. Try summoning him. I, I think it's only a, a daily well, thing. Maybe they won't let you bring, bring him in. Uh, if, uh, if, if, I if, could if do... Uh, that, just, here, Stefan, if... Yeah, just toggle god mode or something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll do a uh, set time scale to, like, 2,000 and wait until tomorrow. If someone asks if you're a god, you say yes. <laughs> uh, and hopefully, in just a little bit, uh, Dude, we can check. That, and that's, that's a journey to to even think about. <laughs> the emperor, this has got to be uncomfortable. You're waiting there 24 hours. I know. Yeah, he, with his back turned, I feel a little bad. Mind, uh, if you're not gonna kill me right now, do you mind oh. if I go take a He's still there. A long way. Thank you for following thank us, X Harley in the twenty-seven. Hey, thank you. We're gonna wait a little bit longer. Uh, I'm gonna uh, eat and drink so I don't like dehydrate myself. I thought I turned that all off. While you're waiting, uh, give give uh, give Discord another volume boost. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let me quickly. Still not there. Okay. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna crank it up right. next time. Mm-hmm. Just a little bit longer. But uh, real quick, chat. Um, I'm just gonna. Turn up Discord one last time. Of course. I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, no, we love doing this. I'm sorry we're having kind of audio issues. Uh, that's that's my bad. Nah, it's all right. Uh, we'll, we'll pretend, pretend, we'll pretend so that how we're... Many people, how many people I'd like to know in the chat are here from uh, uh, Twitter? How many people showed up from Nern posting or uh, Jim yeah. posting? Yeah, uh, where yeah. Where did y'all come from? Please let us let know. Let us know where you came from. We'd love to know. Obviously, we know our uh, our loyal fans, so we know yes. you guys. Yes, thank you, Olga yeah. and uh, Sage and Abby. Uh, All of them, Parsley, Sage, Rosemary, and Tom. Yes. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, no. <laughs> Ignore that. Uh, someone yeah. said Twitter? Someone said Twitter? Cool. Yeah. All right. Uh, another Twitter. I def came yep. from Twitter. Twitter, nice. Yeah, a lot of people from Twitter. Cool. Yeah. And if anybody has any questions for me, I'd be willing to answer them as long as it isn't something that I can't answer. <laughs> <laughs> I came from Philly. Thank you, Allie. I have a question for you. All right. Uh, what uh, What kind of microphone are you using right now? I'm just on my iPhone. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Then I have a question for you. Hmm. Not about... Uh, not about the microphone you're using right now, but what kind of microphones do you use? Like, uh, what microphones do you own? right now, I'm using a Sennheiser 416. I also use an AKG uh, A20 Perception Pro. Uh, it's a tube mic. Uh, it started to bring up a little bit of a buzz recently, which means something went weird with the tube, so I'm getting that one serviced. Uh, but, uh, you know, there are many mics that I would love to try out. I want to get a uh, U87 a Neumann. I uh, want to get a, uh, uh, D- a Don LaFontaine. Remember him? In a world of microphones, <laughs> yes. one man used a gold manly stereo. Wes? Yeah, he, he was great. Oh, thank you for the follow. Oh, yeah. Thank Wes, I think... Um, I think the problem is Lucian Lachance is still somewhere. I don't think he can actually. I just didn't come in this room, and I think that's the problem. Maybe, why I can't get him again? He's barred from the room. I think maybe. They did, maybe the developers didn't want Wes on Wes, uh, Wes on West violence. violence. Wes on Wes violence. Well, that happens all the time in the game, really. But maybe they <laughs> want you to have a personal interaction. Is he still sitting there waiting for you to kill him? He's still yeah. sitting there. So I guess. Um, so how are we gonna? How are you gonna do this now? 
uh, I think that you should uh, you should uh, bore him with poetry to death. Bore him with poetry. Um, let's see. Has it got any here? Bad, is there any bad poetry that you can find? It has to be terrible poetry. He, he's he's got a library here. He might like. Uh, let's see. Um, you could, yeah, I mean, Insane Pixel says you could try move to dot player, but I don't know. I don't know. Uh, oh, that's true. Like. In game ID, but if you find that out, I can look it up for you. I could, yeah. It, I mean, if uh, if someone wants to look it up, because that would be ideal, I think, because Wes Wes himself has requested that. Huh. Well, I don't know if we can make it happen. Maybe it just can't happen. Maybe. I guess. Um. I got. What do I got? I got. Chat with him. See what he says. Ask him what he. What, if, if, if you can chat, what's he saying? Get on with it. Yeah, I think he's just he just wants to get on with it. He's been waiting there for probably a couple of days. So. <laughs> Maybe the West Johnson was the friends we made along the way. That's pretty good. Um, I guess. Do you want pickaxe? Do you want a bow? Do you want a oh, katana? Classic. You want to try pickaxe? pickaxe? Do you want Do you want to be pickaxe to death? Well, it has it has the, the novelty of I'm not having seen it before, but it seems like it would hurt a little bit. Yeah. We, we could also do um I could like someone like a wolf. There's, is there no way to is there no way to uh you know wolf? Oh wait a minute there oh the wolf. Yeah, it's just a wolf. You can't summon Lucy. Oh, he doesn't have a reference. Yeah, because I think he's still. Possibly, I could run out and try to find him. No, you run. I don't know. He should have disappeared. Uh, if, if by resummoning him, he should show up again. But yeah, I don't know. Summon. And uh, someone in chat said he, th he doesn't have an ID code, so I can't, like, spawn him, apparently, which is a little sad. So, I th unfortunately, I think it will have okay. to be Thank my you. player. Yeah. So, if you hit him once with the pickaxe, will the, will the uh, wolf go at him? I think so. So, hit him just... once with the pickaxe and see if the wolf oh. goes the rest. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, that was just kind of disappointing. <laughs> oh, no. Well, he's dead. We could, uh... Yeah, we could try again, maybe. We could, uh... Just punch him this time. Just punch him? <laughs> well, if we punch him, he might get two plus automatically. That's true. But that could be kind of fun. Um, Alright, we'll talk to him again. Uh, we want to get this right, chat. Have you done this before? Have we not? I want you to do me a favor. There's someone who ordered this. I want you to find them. I want you to clip off their fuzzy dice and hang them from your rear view mirror. Would you do this little thing for me? Of course. Ouch. I don't know, you guys. This emperor's kind of creeping me out. We should probably... <laughs> we should probably... One final... One final favor. If you're going to murder me, let's all get undressed first. <laughs> we, we could do that. The emperor that would creep you out, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> we could do that, Wes, if that's what you want. <laughs> I want you to kill me with a refrigerator. <laughs> with a refrigerator. Um, all out, unfortunately. Your Highness, I, I don't even know what that is. <laughs> refrigerator? No. <laughs> all right, let's do it. All right. We, well, we, we already heard this, I guess. I guess we can just kind of skip through this. Yes, kill me. All right. Um, I do have. I remembered. I have these gloves that make punches do more damage. No, because that'll kill him instantly. Okay. You just want to. You just want to summon the wolf. Summon the wolf, and then you want to just slap him a little. Bit. Okay. A little slap. And then once he's. The oh dog, no. He's wow, he's very fragile. He's like glass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. One hit kill every time, maybe? I, th I think it is, yeah. <laughs> right, try uh, oh well, what can you do? What can I do? Um, take all of his robes. Take his robes? Nice yeah, take his robes. There's some extra robes, too. Go look in the drawer. You can get extra. <laughs> oh, yeah? Hey. Okay. Thanks. Hey, thanks for the tips. Yeah, go look in his uh, drawers and all that. There you go. His wardrobe? Yeah, his wardrobe. Uh, he's got some he's fine clothes in here. Off. For, uh, the em he's like he's got he's pretty chiseled. Honestly, Wes, yeah. I mean, all that all that chiseling did him no good when one punch to the head 
killed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, well, what were you working out all that for? You know. Um. <laughs> he's got he's got a buff hard body and, and a fontanelle like a newborn baby. Yeah. <laughs> He was he was reading about the Dark Brotherhood. Yeah, which means that he may have been the one to summon the Dark Brotherhood. I think so. Oh, I didn't want that. I I uh, I know I found the other robes before. I'm not sure. In his quarters, which are in in the past of the locked door. Ah. Oh, like in, in here. That one. Ah. Oh, here they are. Oh, and he has a necklace. I'll steal your gold too. All that stuff. You get everything. Yeah, his rings. Yeah, no. no. It's Take... funny that you said enthralled tipsy. Also, this is we've got a we've got a we've got a chat message. We got a chat message. Uh, yeah, it says I don't know if this is that kind of stream. It is. Uh, <laughs> but I just wanted to take the opportunity to say thanks to Wes for introducing me to the Elder Scrolls series. My first Elder Scrolls memory was my brother talking to Lucy and Lachance, and admittedly I was enthralled. Wow. What is their name? Uh this is our this is our buddy Jack. Hello there, Jack. It's a pleasure. I may have been speaking to your brother, but I am also speaking to you. <laughs> there you go, Jack. There you go, Jack. Now you're, Jack. you're back in the water. Is Lucian over there? I hope he's I, I, I hope I find Lucian somewhere. Like your cat, afraid to get in the water? Maybe, maybe I really hurt his feelings by talking to him saying he smelled like a wet dog. I maybe. <laughs> I, I I don't know where he I is. Smell like a wet dog. I'm not going. <laughs> well, we if he, he strikes me as a sensitive assassin. He's probably mad, yeah. Yeah, I, he, he's a bit of a like a sad boy, you know. No, don't say that. He'll give you an apple. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's true. Yeah, he's famous for his apples. Okay. We well, don't know, Ultra. we don't know. He, he vanished. I, I, yeah, and I can't resummon him because he's not technically dead. So I, th I think Wes, you're just gonna have to make up for um, your spirit's uh, incompetence and do the voices yourself. I think. My spirit's incompetence. Wow, you <laughs> sound like my wife. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, no, she says nice things about my incompetence. Oh, that's good. <laughs> You know, the, the, the nice things you can't say about one's incompetence. She says them all. So where are you heading? Are you going to go kill that guy now? I think uh, we're going to actually uh, meet uh, with a, um, a certain uh, Daedric prince. Um, okay. I, I hear he's... So well, you can get to that guy eventually. You know where he's at. you got to go pick up the money from uh, Mojier. That's true, yeah. paid for the job. What was it 15,000 gold or something? Uh, yeah. 20. Yeah. 20,000? Any big ones. But then the thing is, refurbishing the uh, Dark Brotherhood costs 19. No, oh, it doesn't really. Right. Well, that's that's an optional quest. You don't have to do that. You can take the money and run. Yeah, and then have the Dark Brotherhood look like crap. Well. Have you yep. already spoken? Have you already spoken to the uh, homeless guy? I did, yeah. And I have the hip bone, so we're ready to just uh, walk right into Please, the palace. My master. <laughs> <laughs> And um, actually, I think we're gonna need a change of um, change of costume, I believe. Oh, of course. Because uh, we have uh, we have this new gear, so we're gonna. You're gonna dress up like the emperor inside the emperor's mind. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, at least this emperor was dead before the one that we see. Just... I think. Uh, and well, now they're together again. He had some rings and a necklace. I think it was. So. Um... Oh, I still I still got my. Yeah, so, it's not like it's covered in blood or anything, because you just punched him in. <laughs> yeah. I think, uh... I, I think, uh, Shea Gorath would be... He, he, he would be into that kind of look, I think. So, uh... Cheek. There we go. He, he, he respects you dressing like the pimp daddy, so no... <laughs> nice. Oh, there we go. There we go. The oh, are we going in that side or the oh. other side? Do we have to, um... Oh, we have to we have to talk to we have to talk to the uh, that's right we have to talk to Erdy over here. Erdy, I, I have to say, when I, no I, when I uh, was playing Blades and it, it first got the voice update, uh, 
and I went over and I talked to this guy and it was Theodore Gorlash and I was like you know I didn't think anything of it and then I was like oh, oh. wait that's Wes and then I was like wait that's Wes doing the Shea Gorath voice wait that's Shea Gorath <laughs> <laughs> yeah well, the, skies. The, eyes, the eyes were a dead giveaway mm-hmm. and also mm-hmm. it's an anagram yeah and uh, yes. in honor of that uh, maybe we could see uh, my character's actually named Theodore yeah, Gorlash <laughs> so <laughs> oh god what is this like perk mod. Oh yeah, I've I've ordinator. That's that's oh, right. it's or- ordinator. Yeah, I don't. I hey, don't I don't like ordinator that much. This is a a good opportunity to. Uh, yeah, it's very cobwebby up here. Uh, they, never the spiders. they never does. No. I'm an arachnophobe. <laughs> this is a good time to mention. I do a Skyrim playthrough. Um, on my YouTube so. channel. Feel free to check it out. Oh. This be. I remember the whole sort of affair. A fox, a severed head, and cheese. The dying for. Oh God, now I want cheese. <laughs> we brought some with us. There's the only drawback of being a Daedric god. It's all the slow colons because of the cheese. Yeah, the custom introduction. Really, it's beautiful. Is the uh, the cherry on top? Oh, we got some. Call me Anne-Marie. but only if you're partial. Having your rope, your endrils, skip by like rope. <laughs> what will it be? Mm-hmm. Shall I pluck your eyes? All the colors. They appear to be beautiful. I could use them on my staff to share for us. It needs replenishing every once in a while. You know what this meal could be? How about brain pie? <laughs> Perfect. Care to donate. I'm so happy. Okay. Shea Gorath, meet Shea Gorath. <laughs> <laughs> you know, here's the thing. I used to look like whatever you looked like when you were back in oblivion. I don't care if you were a Khajiit or you were some kind of a, a mutant or maybe you were female. It doesn't matter because you take the staff of Shea Gorath for over 200 years. I'm going to mental you. Oh, yeah. I'll mental you hard. Wow. It, I think that alone got us a new follower from Goblin. So you thank you so much. <laughs> um, um, I guess we're, we're here to deliver a message. I can't see what all those people are saying. Oh, no. I'm sorry. It's so very small, so if you see anybody saying anything to me, let me know. I wish Zedge had Sheo saying, I said good day as a sound. I oh. said good day. <laughs> the, uh... <laughs> I think we all want... Really Wonka crossover that we all need. We all want that suit, I think. Clipping. 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 You know you did. You stole some fizzy lifting drink. <laughs> and I had to wash the walls from your filthy little hand. Uh, Shea Gorath, would you be able to say, um, something about Soleil sparkling water by any chance? No. <laughs> What's our favorite sparkling water? Now you're trying to get the full bay, are you? What you need is a nice... You need to go to the celebrity deli is what you need. Forget about your safe. Go to the celebrity deli. So much better. And if you look around, you might even find pictures of me. It's true. If you, uh, please go check out Celebrity Deli if you have the time. Um, uh, I've I've been asked to retrieve you from your vacation, Wes. Oh, hard to hear, Mark and Calvin. Uh oh. Is that an elephant trunk? Oh yeah, no. It is. Well, it's a mammoth trunk. It right, is a mammoth, mammoth trunk. trunk. <laughs> oh, I thought you were complimenting me. <laughs> yeah, it, yeah, it's just it's just your dinner. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is incredible. I'll just sit here with my arms folded for a while. <laughs> Hopefully. 
You know, back when I was me, before I became me again, through you, I liked my hair just a bit better. Now it's sort of lifeless, you know. I have to shampoo it with dead emperor's blood, and it just leaves it listless and hanging. Oh, did we lose people? Uh, no, 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 we're good. Oh, okay, just want to make sure. I, I was wondering what his uh, grooming secret was. Yeah. Now we know it's no, emperor we... blood. Of course it is. Oh, we're right here in the middle of a dead emperor's mind, you know. It's true. It's probably gray matter. Yeah, you, know, you try soaking it. <laughs> really makes the hair like uh, thin and stringy, you know. <laughs> it lays down flat, you know. You, you, you would think that that the dead brains would be good for fluffing the hair up, but it's just the opposite. Is he still over there? Very disorienting. Is he, st is he still there? Pelagius? I think I think he uh I think he teleported to another dimension. God, he's around he's here somewhere. Here, there. He's, Yikes. he's so sensitive. You talk about him being dead, about being insane, and he's like, ah blah blah yeah, blah. So really Which is why I give you the Wabba Jack. Huh? <sighs> the Wabba Jack. You weren't expecting that. And I'll need you to go around and start sapping things. Clear out the mind of Pelagius. Oh, put a, put a, a dead emperor to rest. This is one of my favorite quests. I love the Wabajack so much. I think uh, we're going to be using it. Hey, Chad, are we a little easier to hear now? Let us know. Let us know. The brothers just turned up their gain. Uh, we might be peaking a little bit, but you know what? When we're competing with Wes Johnson's powerful voice, we have to peak. <laughs> it's an oh, you too young to peak. Give yourself a few more years. <laughs> hey! We got the Lava Jack. Yes! I am Mel Hello, Dabians. Hey, Beans. Dabians. The Beans. Uh, and then, um. Alright, we. A little better. I guess we'll go this way. A little better. That's good. Um. Don't at me. I can make this uncomfortably loud for you guys. Yeah, where where did you get that? Wes is quiet too. Stefan, can you just turn your voice down? I can just turn my voice down. I'm just gonna one one second, chat. Turn, turn yours down and turn Discord up. Yep. I'll, I I got it when I, I I have to remember the name of the battle mage, something like that. It's from Spain. A group in Spain mm -hmm. created it for me. That's and now of course, yeah, they they made it and they shipped it over and uh, I got the very first one and now they're actually making them for people. <gasps> Ooh. Watch. I'm going to find uh, out. Yeah, we can... Hold on, I'll figure... Uh, uh, this is a bad time to forget how to Logica. change... Do, go to the Discord volume mixer. Or I guess it would be Twitch Studio volume mixer, wouldn't it? That's what I'm thinking of. Oh. Uh, so I'm going to turn myself down and turn everybody else up. So how's yeah, this? Let's see. Is that better? That, that might... should be way better. Let us know if it's too much the other direction now. We don't need to hear stuff on Lindsay. Brutal. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, Jeez. It's true. It's true, though. Wes is the star here. This is good? Okay. He has this is good? Lovely. Excellent. Let's get back into it. We're going to Linda, we jack some wabbas. Yay! To find his terrors easy to repel, but persistent. Jack, come on. All right. We have got to wait. Uh, you you thought, thought it was a bit. Good. Wait. You thought that us having Wes was War a bit. Warblade Studio. A lot better. Good. I'm glad it's better. Warblade Studio. Lindsay, yep. you thought that us bringing Wes on the stream was a bit. <laughs> ah, no, oh, it's cool. not a bit. It's on their this, is, page. this is real. Yeah, Warblade Studio. This is real. And, uh, I've got a nice blade from them that they created uh, the Wabba Jack. I wonder if they're still making the Wabba Jacks. It looks like their stuff is... Their stuff is all Skyrim. Wow, that's really detailed. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it's very high quality. Oh, there we go. And it, like, also, the prices seem to range. They also created me a one-of-a-kind. Oh, I don't know if their Wabajack is... Uh, if they're still making the Wabajack. Other people make Wabajack, but their stuff is great. I bet if you ask yeah. them they still have the template, they can make the one. Probably. Great. No, Lindsay! <laughs> Wes Johnson is actually... Real life friend. He's yeah. here. Wow. Jack, probably my favorite. Hey. Yeah. I I can relate to that because it's like, <laughs> yeah, I I can say like, oh well, I just like a maxed out dragon bones. No, that's lame. Like, that's lame. No. 
It's all about the The Wabajack is play. too chaotic to pass up. Whee. Did you see the roll? I did see the I did roll. I see it. All right. Do it again. Roll. For the bit. Uh. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, next. Ah. Uh, so, Wes, I have another question for you since I'm a huge nerd for this Wait, stuff. What kind of headphones do you have? <laughs> uh, use the uh, Sennheiser 360 Pros. 360s, though? Yeah, I, I was actually looking at those. The 360s are better for me than the uh, 260s because they have a bigger uh, ear cup and it doesn't hurt my ears. They, and they, they sound fantastic. I I have uh, a pair of HD 599s. I've got an AKG set of AKG headphones as well, and some people swear by them. But I just I love my uh, my Sennheiser. I when I was in the in radio for years and years with HFS and places like that, I used to wear the old uh, uh, Sony uh, Pros, you know, and mm. those are great. But I I just I love these Sennheisers so much better. They're just they feel like home on my head. Yes. That's yeah, I like the way mine feel. I I'm a oh, huge Sennheiser God, fan. They make really good headphones. Well, good for me. Um, they make good headphones that aren't like insane, like you know, multi thousand dollar planar magnetic headphones. Then also they have a couple pair of two thousand dollar headphones and the pair of sixty thousand dollar headphones in the amp. But you know, yeah, but I mean, that's a joke. Yeah, I mean, if, if, what are you listening to that's uh, gonna really be worth that? You know, uh, if you're voice of God. richer than yeah, if you're richer than God. <laughs> uh, we've got a good question in the chat. That's true. Uh, do you all remember when you picked up Skyrim slash played it for the first time? Uh, yes, I do. I definitely My do. answer is yes. Um, I actually didn't play it till 2013. 2013, I think. But that was when I played it. Yeah. But I do remember. I remember it vividly, actually. <laughs> so I, I was You're not. You're missing that guy. You gotta hit him down there. What are you, what are you missing him for? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Wes. Um, Chagorath is alive and well. Yeah, I do remember. Please, please get on him uh, first time. Uh, well, well, the thing is, you're supposed to point it. You don't just oh. willy nilly fire it any which way. I'm so happy I have. It, there's such a thing as a. Uh, uh, too much random insanity even when it comes to Shigora. No. Absolutely no. not. Yeah. All no. Uh, my, my first time playing Skyrim was, I think I also picked it up 2013 um, and uh, I'd been playing uh, Morrowind before that uh, for a little while. So. I have a save. Skyrim was my first like real what you have to like. uh like, I, I never finished Morrowind or Oblivion. Like, Skyrim was the first Elder Scrolls game that I, like, went through completely. And I, I remember playing it the first time. And I was an orc, and then I was like, actually, I don't like being a brute. And then I was a dark elf. I think my first character was a dark elf, yeah. I think it was a yeah, my dark first... elf night blade, I think. In Oblivion, I always played as the uh, Imperials, because why not? It was me. Yeah, he got it. Right. Voice, True. You know? So if I'm, if I'm swinging a broadsword and attacking or fighting or getting attacked, it's my own voice. It's like, you know, how much closer to actually playing in that world can you get? Yeah. True. Did you, uh, I, did you see that? I saw a tweet earlier that said, uh, if you were born in Cyrodiil around the third era, there's a 50% chance you're voiced by Wes Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> That that gave me a laugh when I saw it. Capital. What's the mad emperor of Tamriel? I I always feel so sad leaving uh, Sheogorath. Sheogorath, yeah. Yeah. Is it just me or does that thing that seat look like it flushes? It, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, is, is there a Sheogorath world? Is there a switch somewhere? <laughs> There's a reason why they call it the throne. <laughs> True. <laughs> well, guys, I, I'm on here for about the next uh, 10 minutes or so. So if you have any questions, feel free to toss them on out now. Ask them while you can. Uh, we have one question here. Wes, did you play any of the other games before Oblivion? Uh, asks uh, Whiskers Von Thor, brother. I, uh, I was in Morrowind, and I played probably about 600 hours on Morrowind to the point where you're playing the, the game, and uh, you go to sleep at night, and you dream in that world. The, the world stays with you, you know? And that actually came in handy later on because of my experience playing Morrowind. 
uh, I think it changed the way I voiced things starting with Oblivion because I imagined that world. It was in my mind. It was in my head. Yeah. We can, uh, so it's easier, easier to be immersed in the whole reality of it when you play the game and feel so, it feels so immersive. Right. Right. That, yeah. I mean, it, it's, it's, and it's something that, uh, all of the Elder Scrolls games that I've played are, you know, they all make you feel that way. You know, it's 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 the magic touch. <laughs> yeah. How many of you have decided to play uh, about a half an hour before you go to bed? The next thing you know, the birds are chirping outside. Yeah. Your day yep. Oh, it's it's Absolutely. several times in my life. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna quickly before what we else? head to what the else? final quest we're doing tonight. I'm just gonna quickly turn off some of these turn things. Off the spot. Uh, yeah. Okay, second one we got is, uh, how did you get involved in voice work for games specifically? I was doing uh, auditioning for things. I was working in radio, doing sketch mm -hmm. comedy, doing stand-up comedy, working in film. And the casting agency that was uh, giving me you know, auditions for films and TV shows and things of that sort got me an audition for video games. And the first game I voiced was called Unreal 2. I think it's The mm -hmm. Awakening. And I didn't play an actual character in there. What I was, was everybody who ever died. I basically spent like four hours being 200 different people dying in spectacular ways. So if somebody dies of blood curdling or gruesome death or anything during Unreal 2, or you're attacking and they're screaming, I basically was the living embodiment of the Wilhelm scream uh, in that game. So... Uh, but then I, I started doing other games after that through auditions. And once you start doing enough audition, you get enough games under your belt and you have a demo reel to send out, uh, you get a chance to do other games. So I ended up doing uh, Morrowind and then uh, mm. Fallout and started doing Star Trek and then World of Warcraft and things of that sort. It's uh, it's been It's been a lot of fun. Do you have... Um... I, I guess, do you have a favorite uh, character that you've voiced before? Like, would it be an Elder Scrolls character or would it be someone else? I would say my my biggest favorites have to be, it's a split between uh, Shea Gorath and Lucian Lachance. Those okay. two are kind of like my babies yeah. in yeah. creating them. Um, you know, it's creating the voices. I didn't create the characters, but I did develop the voices for the characters. Right. And uh, I love those guys. But I mean, I still feel very close to a lot of different characters. Uh, Hermes Mora, Dragonborn. And I love a lot of my voices for uh, Fallout series, you know, like, Fox, not know why people don't attack when you are around. <laughs> Or, uh, you know, you're Mo Cronin from Diamond City. You want to get yourself a nice squatter, you know, like some, some hefty hickory, you know. Uh, or, or he was one the, of my favorites. Are the Silver Shroud, Mistress of Mystery. We shall take down the mechanist, and justice will prevail. Um, he was fun, and uh, yeah, that's great. All the Protectron robots I played throughout the different series. So really, really quickly, uh, Whiskers von Thorbugger, yes, uh, Wes voices Hermes Moore. Didn't you uh, voice him in the DLC and then you got like added to the base game Hermes Moore lines? No, I did uh, Hermes Moore in. Uh, I did Hermes. Uh, see, there's Hermes right yeah, there. Yeah, there he right? is right there. Now, Gorgar that was Finks. the first that was the first Hermaeus I did in uh in Skyrim but I did him in Oblivion as mm -hmm. well. And then we added him in the regular game. I did him there and then I did him for the DLC afterwards. So I Right, for, right, right. I did him for two games in a DLC. Right, right. Oh, but he doesn't he like he the model used to look different before the Dragonborn DLC, didn't it? It looked different. It was sort of like a uh of just a sort of a purplish mist. They yeah. changed the look of him, but they didn't change his voice. I oh, okay. I knew something changed. I think that's a mod. There are a lot more tentacles yeah. now. After yes, they, I can yeah, I can tell that. More yeah. explosive sounds. Okay. Yes. Also, yes, Stefan, uh, do you know who Gargar Finks is based on the name? Gargar Finks asks, do you know who I am based on the name? Gargar Finks. I, I I have a few guesses. Gargar Finks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, th I think I know. A lot of goat eyes. Yes. 
<laughs> I, 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 Star Wars pun name. I think I think I can guess who that is. Yeah. We we did have a Sheagorath lore related question, which I I'm not I'm not a lore guy, so I can't make well, I'm heads not or tails the expert of this. on the lore, but I can just give you my opinion. Mm, okay, right, that works. All right, that's we'll honestly probably what he wants more. <laughs> What was the deal with the Ministry of Truth slash Bar Dow above Vivek City in Marwind, I assume, mm -hmm. right? Yes. Was it a passing whimsy or something else? I don't know because as far as I'm concerned, I believe that that was Haskell answering the phone. That wasn't me. The voice <laughs> in Morrowind was Jeff Baker. Mm. But Jeff ah. Baker is Haskell, you see. And his voice sounds different. So I believe that it was Haskell basically answering Sam. the old statue phone because Shea Gorath is off gallivanting in some uh, you know dead emperor's mind and oh, he's got to pick up the phone and answer so he puts on a little voice uh, so you know that that you weren't speaking to Shea Gorath you're speaking to Haskell interesting there you go there you go that's uh, just one man's opinion by the way it's basically <laughs> the man's opinion it's the yeah man. <laughs> And then we have another question. Uh, how much of the voice direction is something you just decide on, or did the do the the video game directors, the voice directors, oh, ask it's, for it's specific very collaborative. It's very collaborative. Mm -hmm. The video game director mm -hmm. for a lot of the things I've done has been uh, Mark Lampert, who's amazing, and does and develops so many of the sounds and the oral landscape that you hear in these games. He's just remarkable. And sometimes the devs and the writers come in and they'll give you suggestions on how to go with certain things. Um, like with Shea Gorath, they had an idea in mind for me to do it more Robin Williams like. And I thought, no, I want to take him partially as like a Billy Connolly because Billy is a scarier stand up than Robin. And uh, he's very Scottish. But I also wanted to throw in like an Irish accent because I knew some Irish guys. And since he was manic and he was the mania and dementia, I wanted it to go back and forth so you didn't know where he was at any given time. And occasionally he drops the accent altogether, like when he's asking about brain pie. And he's like, care to donate? No, he doesn't say it like that. He's like, brain pie, perfect. Care to donate? So you see, I, I throw little things in there like that. From what I understand, even Todd was listening to it later at first and it wasn't what he expected. But then he said, no, it's starting to grow on me. He really began uh. to like it. So, you know, you can bring your own ideas and your own interpretations in and your own characters. Uh, they may ask you to go a certain way or try something different. Once you're in the booth and you've got directors and you've got writers on the other side, it, it, it can become very collaborative. But uh, I do get a chance to be very creative when it comes to uh, creating a voice. That's really cool. Um, a question I had is, I kind of imagine it being, especially in like video game voice acting, is I imagine it being kind of lonely where you're like the only one in the studio. When you have dialogue, like in the Shea Gorath quest, you're talking to uh, Pelagius III, are you there with the other voice actor? Or is I'm it... not. Okay. I'm not. There's two games I've done with Patrick Stewart where I actually interacted with him. One was... Uh, was uh... Uh, oblivion okay at the beginning i was still one of the guards right. in, in right, the right, right. beginning with him and also in uh, star trek uh uh legacy okay. i was uh the klingon i was uh the klingon ambassador got in a big a, a, a captain who got into a big fight menvek i'm you have no honor we shall destroy you enterprise you know things of okay. that yeah nature. Yeah. So, you know, I got to work and act with uh, Patrick Stewart, but I never met the man. I would love to, oh. right. but I, <laughs> I've, worked with, I've worked with him twice. Um, the only time I ever actually met one of the guys that I was working with was when I was doing uh, Elder Scrolls Legends, the card game, and I was playing the arena announcer. And I was also playing Shea Gorath, who comes in, attacks and knocks out the arena announcer and takes <laughs> over. So about West about West your violence. West on West Violence. Yeah, yeah. there, yeah. there, there we are. Is. All right, Wes, we have two more questions for you. And then we'll right. we'll uh, release you from your uh, bonds here. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so Jack, again, it's Tipsy, asked, uh, one last question for me. Which non-game-related voice role did you enjoy doing the most? Voice role or, I'll say, role in general. Yeah, not just, it well, can be anything. Then I would say probably uh, doing the John Waters film, A Dirty Shame. 
where I played, uh, yeah, Fat Fuck Frank, <laughs> Triple F, or in the R-rated version, Fat Freak Frank, whatever you want to call him. You know, any I was I was uh, Selma Blair's biker boyfriend in an NC-17 film. Like that'll ever happen again. And I got to to act with people like uh, Tracy Ullman and Johnny Knoxville and Chris Isaac and Suzanne Shepard and Mink Stoll and and be directed by John Waters and uh, spend a month in Baltimore. Uh, basically being a member of his uh, his crew. And uh, it was just delightful. And I've lost a lot of weight. I've lost over 200 pounds. Wow. I've lost 200 pounds since I played Triple F. And right. uh, I got to see John at a Christmas show at the Birchmere this past year. And he didn't nice. recognize me at first. So I took a book <laughs> up to get it autographed by him. And he's like, yeah, who'd you like to make it out to? And I was like, would you make it out to Fat Fuck Frank? And he looked up and he looked at me and he's like, is that you? It's like, <laughs> yeah. Hey, so that was cool. That was very satisfying. Yeah, yeah. That's really of cool. And it's you like said- you lose that much weight, you might as well be in the witness protection program. True. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hanging in Baltimore with John Waters is as legit as it gets, That's honestly. Tr- it's true. Yeah. yeah. All right. And then the final one. Yeah, I the think final question. To, uh, to uh, end your. Uh, your tenure on here, but uh, <laughs> uh, Whiskers says, uh, I, I'm sure you must get this one a lot, but do you have any specific pieces of advice for people interested in voice acting? Mm. We do a lot of that. I'm actually teaching a class for students age 13 to 19 right now in video game voice acting at Theater Lab in DC. Yes, you cool. look that up online. Uh, I'm doing a Saturday morning class for uh, kids for just cartoon voices uh, from eight grades uh, five through eight. But uh, we've there, I understand they may be doing a class soon for video game voice acting class soon for adults. When we've done the oh, cool. mag fest and different conventions, we've had the video game uh, voice actor workshop and it's been very popular. And uh, I enjoy putting people through their pay. Who get that thing? Hey. Yeah. <laughs> um, I have jacked him. You wobble jack them, turn them into what? A chicken? Then you can't attack them. I think uh, they're sacred. I, I turned into a pile of uh, ghostly remains there. Nice. <laughs> is, is there something in it? Check and see if there's something in it. Uh, yeah, I guess might as well. Probably. Uh, oh, we got some. Okay, we got yeah. some ore. We got some scrap metal. There you go. So, um, <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. But, oh, but God. Something. Oh, that was not a good switch. That's <laughs> me, too. <laughs> yeah. Suddenly, I show up and it's like, "Oh, that's right!" Oh, right. Okay. oh yeah, of course. Yeah, well, we should have had a Dramora. That's a that's, that's my bad. Metal blood. Oh, there we go. Now we got a chicken. Oh, it's chicken. Oh, I think. All right. Something we can do, possibly. Oh, maybe not. We can't push him. Yeah, we, let him be. Let him. Could, hang. Um... He's a chicken. But uh, here's something I would suggest to you guys: if you are interested, D. Bradley Baker, a voice actor. Uh, has a, a web page that's just wonderful with tons of information. Go to I want to be a voice actor.com and check that out. It's really great information, whether you're just starting out or if you've been in for a while. I just noticed you're still wearing the Emperor's clothes, just by the way. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I, D, I, D Bradley Baker is, is great. Um, that's mm-hmm. I'll, I'll have to look into that myself as I've well. I've got the. Uh... So. The Wes Johnson, like chicken, kicking. Thank you, Alta. Alta, put the link in the chat. Thank you, Alta. Playing the unique game of chicken, kicking. We already, we already partook. <laughs> Finger licking, good chicken, kick. Yeah, it was, it was very satisfying to uh, Fusro daw that chicken into um, some like dwarven traps. That's one of the more satisfying. If things. you can hit it hard enough, people don't know this, but if you hit the chicken hard enough with the Fusro daw, it turns into a pot pie. Oh, interesting. <laughs> Does it no, really? it doesn't. I, I just made that up. But that <laughs> that would, yeah. Okay, someone needs to make that into like a mod now. <laughs> like, That'd be like, who's road dinner? <gasps> yeah, no, for real. Yeah, um, yeah uh, Goblin, we stripped the Emperor when we... Uh, oh, yeah. West, yeah, it was, yeah. Wes's Take command, you know? Yeah. Hey, those were my clothes. You killed me. I gave them to you. It was my gift. Yeah. It was okay. <laughs> we had consent. Also, Enthused Horseman, thank you for tuning in. Unfortunately, Norseman. Susan Norseman, goodness gracious, I can read. And Susan Norseman, uh, <laughs> unfortunately, Wes is uh, going to be tuning out soon. But mm. we are well, does, be does Norseman have a question before we go? Yeah, yeah. Okay, if Wes is open to it, do you have a question for him before uh, before he leaves? 
We'll wait for a little bit. We'll know in a few seconds. Yeah. Now we gotta mod it. Oh, now we gotta mod the chicken pot pie. We gotta pie add chicken pot pie, yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll learn how to mod. Oh god, the pressure! The pressure. No, you can also no, just no turn pressure. it into a bucket of chicken. That would be nice, too. Uh, that, yeah, like a, with like KFC branding on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> KFC who? Did you ever see the Lefebvre Brothers video where I turned him into a chicken? Uh, yes, uh, outside right outside the, deli. Uh, the deli. Yeah. Right outside the <laughs> magic happens at the Celebrity Deli in Falls Church. Okay. We have a really good question for you. This is actually the perfect one to cut out to end the stream with. <laughs> what is your favorite chicken recipe, Wes? Ooh. Favorite method of preparing chicken. That's a good mm. question. From Enthuse Norseman. I have so many different ways of preparing the chicken, but I think a nice uh, – I made one the other day. I, agree, I saw Sam. it on Facebook. And what you do is you get yourself some ham and you get yourself some nice cheese. Uh, not not like just regular American cheese. All that. I guess you could use that. But I get got like some Gouda and things of that sort. And you put the ham and the cheese down and slice it into like little strips. And then you take the chi You can bread the chicken breast and then you slice it down the center. By this point, it's looking really rude. But don't worry about that. You then stuff the chicken. You take the strips of ham and cheese and you put them in the slot of the chicken in the center, and then you get yourself some uh, white sauce, get yourself a nice Blanca sauce, and you pour that. I like the Parmesan Alfredo. Mm, you pour yes. that over top of the uh, the cheese in that open wound of the chicken, then you get yourself some Parmesan cheese and cover it all up, sprinkle it, put it in the oven, bake it on 400 for over 20 to 25 minutes, and it is absolutely delicious. That sounds amazing. There it is. Let's uh, let's do a cooking stream where we make the uh, the ham cheese chicken recipe. The West Johnson. We're basically taking notes. <laughs> yeah. Someone clip Boop. that. Boop. We gotta have that recipe. Yeah. The West yeah, Johnson West know. recipe. Can you tweet your recipe, West? <laughs> Actually, it's on it's on Facebook. I I sent it out when I did it. But my one of my things I like that nobody asked, yeah, I make uh, some mean nachos, man. Mm. Oh, nice. I believe it. Yeah, those are, you know, and, and the, the main ingredient, using scoopables. Get yourself some ah. pepper jack cheese. You dice it up mm. into little cubes. You take a little bit of salsa of your choice. You can go spicy, mild, whatever you like. And you put that salsa, a little dip of the salsa around the uh, pepper jack cheese that's inside there. Then you get yourself some shredded Mexican cheese and you fill the rest of the, each cup. You lay it all out on a pan and then you get some uh, cumin. And some mm. uh, chili powder, and you sprinkle the cumin and chili powder all across the top. And then what do you do? You make another stack right on top of the first stack, and you, you fill them up, and you keep going until you've made yourself a little tower of uh, these these nachos with the cheese and the cumin and the chili powder. Then you put it in the mic or in the oven at 425 for about 10 minutes until it's crispy, bubbly, golden brown. Take it out and just make yourself sick with joy the nacho tower that sounds like what i do every time i eat taco bell <laughs> the nacho tower of doom yeah <laughs> we need west Sean's... back on just to describe food for a while <laughs> that's uh it's okay we'll be we will be we will be making highlights of this worry not yeah and um also i will be uploading this whole thing to youtube um so you want to know the best way to make some eggs? <laughs> yes. I, I First know. of all, you got to get yourself a Gotham Steel Pancake Bonanza pan. Just look it up. Type in Gotham Steel Pancake Bonanza. It's basically a little pan. It's like a, a bellows. It's got uh, a pan on each oh, side. Oh, yeah. And you, you put a little uh, uh, <laughs> sea, salt, uh, sea salt olive oil butter. Just a little yep. coat of it in there. You grab yourself some diced onions and saute them just a little bit. Crack two jumbo eggs, put them inside. You're going to do a little black pepper. And then when that starts to uh, solidify, you you go go to the CVS and get one of those uh, garlic herb grinders. It's the best. Garlic, it's made by Gold Emblem. It's the best. You grind that on top of it, flip it over, just flip the pan. And then on the other side, you do more of the garlic herb. And then you take some of the four cheese it's got the little romano and the, the parmesan and a few others in it four cheese shredded cheese just sprinkle it around the edges 
of the egg and then a little ah, bit of parmesan oh motier you're going down oh yeah um, <laughs> I, I was gonna wa- i was gonna wa- uh, wabba jack and wabba jack him wabba jack oh that would be cool my friends you may not be by the way i think that the guard on the outside is in on with, in with you, you uh he was already paid off they knew uh, this guy's yeah, going down <laughs> but uh <laughs> anyway once you that quits a little golden brown and caramelized is on the edge take it right out slide it right out of the pan and it's uh, most it's delicious. You can even put uh, uh, some guacamole, or some guacamole, avocado spread on it. Now please go. Yes. Oh. Collect your Fra- sh- chef's kiss. <laughs> yeah. I, I know we were thinking about having a food stream at some point where we, we would be like cooking and stuff. Um, so now I we think, have to. But now we get. Now we, we have, have to. to. We have to make the West Johnson specialties. Um, <laughs> I think um, before you go off, uh, Wes, I think we're gonna. We're gonna do. We're gonna give this guy the Shea Goreth Classic. Excellent. <laughs> Watch, he's a dragon. Okay, well that oh. was uneventful. Oh, he's a mud crab. Okay, well. What? <laughs> that worked. That works. Did you see that twenty thousand yeah, bounty? Go back. Take everything he's got. Don't leave him there. There's um, other things to find around this room. I'd rather die than go to prison. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fight my way out. We're gonna, we're gonna wabba jack oh every guard. Wait, you gotta take, you gotta take his stuff. You gotta take Please. his stuff. Do it. He's got, he's got gems of plenty. We're gonna leave his clothes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Okay, come back in. Shut the door next time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I think Don't it's... use the wabba jack. Don't use the wabba jack and just kill him with a blade. Okay. What? <laughs> Wes's orders. You go we, in, shut the door behind you. Uh-huh. There he is. Tell him that. I know, I know. Oh, well, tell him that you're dead. We killed our, we killed our guest. Uh-huh. Yeah, cool. and he gives Probably you money. Decent. Make sure you get paid first. That's always wise. Don't kill him before he pays you. I think he just tells us where the uh, cash is, right? right? Yeah. You want I mean, you could also just player dot add item f twenty thousand. That's true, but uh. Cheating. So. It's a bit, Mark. Stop. It's just a bit. <laughs> now, please. Yeah, 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 kill him, kill him. Collect your money, and let us never look upon one uh, another. And we're gonna right. blade him as Wes Johnson has requested. Uh, the so door is closed, right? Yeah. Yep. Just <laughs> gotta get up, get up close, oh, get up shit. close. All right, we're gonna we're gonna sneak up behind him, maybe. Oh uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. There we go. Yeah. But we had a deal. Oh, he looks so like relaxed. Look at yeah, him. He's just sleeping. Nap. Take everything he's got. Like take I don't think they'll even notice got. that he's dead for a little while. Take even take his clothes. Leave him sitting in his underwear. Okay. No dignity. There you go. No he's dignity. Just slapping. No dignity. Yeah. Can we put a little hat on him? Ah. No, maybe not. No. Are there any buckets yeah. in the room? Are there Are there any buckets? There's a basket. We can There's try. There's a it. basket. So like a cauldron out in the main. Oh. All right, we're gonna we're we're gonna find a we're gonna find a bucket or a cauldron. <laughs> See, they're gonna f- you now. There's a there's a cast iron pot. I think that would do. We'll steal that. Probably do it. Just just carry. Oh, okay, that works too. I don't, it's, it would count as stealing though. So. Do you have realism mods or something? No, I think it's just it's just uh, item. No, if you just if you just hold it and pick it up, it doesn't work. Oh yeah, I didn't well, I didn't know that. Wow, how long have you been playing this game? <laughs> like 800 Ooh. hours or something. Oh, oh no. Okay. Oh. I think people will know I... he's dead now, but... Uh... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> nope, nope. I, I, yeah, um... Oh. It's close. It's really close. It looks like a too big fedora. <laughs> I think maybe we just... You know what, just, just, like... There we go. That's got, gonna have to do. <laughs> he got crushed by a pot that fell from the ceiling, and that's why he's done. Yeah. Dead. What else you got up there on top? Up top, up we up got we got top. a few jugs. We can just we can just anything in there. In here? Yeah. What did he have? I think. Uh, okay, he had some. He had some merchant boots. I'll take the boots. Uh, merchant some, boots. Ah, uh, he has some gold. <gasps> Five gold. Uh, goblet. Take the wine. Hundred hours amateur apples. I'll just steal everything he has. He had a book, another goblet. Okay, 
I think I think we've robbed man. Oh, we can't forget the most important part. Jeez. Jeez. Yeah, there it is. There we go. All right, Wes. Yeah, we thank you so there. much. Thank you so much for joining this us. Was... It has been a oh, blast. Oh, it's been such a pleasure. Wonderful to see you. And of course, Calvin and Mark. Uh, we haven't had a chance to hang with you or do the Zoom Fest or anything of that nature, but this was lovely too. Yeah, I, th I, this, I think this is the best we can do during these quarantine times, but uh, maybe in the future uh, we can do Guaranteed. another. You know we'll have a good time then. Got something Absolutely. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Monochromatic stains. <laughs> uh, chat saying bye. Yeah. Fairly nights. well, everyone. Cool. Stick around while these guys continue like playing Skyrim. Let's see if yeah. they make it to the end. Go, <laughs> visit, go say it. Give some love to Hermaeus Mora for me. Oh, yeah. I think we, we just have to find a Dark Elf to uh, to harvest blood some... from. And then uh, I think that should be everything. I wish you well, Dragonborn. I was too busy playing Skyrim to watch the Skyrim stream. Yeah, that's relatable. Oh, all right. Thank you. You... Well, so long, farewell. <laughs> I'll be the same. I'll be the same. Goodbye. goodbye. Adieu. Adieu to you and you and you. Thank you so much, Wes. You have a great night. Lovely. And you too. Bye, Wes. Goodbye. Good night, guys. Take care. Nice Bye, talking Wes. to you. Bye. All right. I'm sorry, monochromatic stains. I'm so sorry that you came in just as he was leaving. Oh, um, yeah. Uh, but don't, don't worry. Uh, we are gonna uh, make a highlight of it, and it'll stay up on Twitch, and uh, it's also gonna go on YouTube. It's also so gonna go on YouTube, so yeah, worry. no, no fear. Uh, what a nice we should, um We should do another. Uh, do you wanna do you wanna put my YouTube link up, uh, brothers? Wait, so which YouTube is it going on? Is it going on yours or the brothers' YouTube? I'll leave it up to you. Both, honestly, we could do we could do like a two parter. That's true. We could do like one part on each channel, so that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, um, sure. Yeah, we can do it that way. Okay, cool. Or we cool. can we can just upload it twice too, because I have the uh, Skyrim That's playthrough. True. But it is yeah. it is a real uh, Whiskers, life brothers. Whiskers, so we will be comfortable with it and we'll verify with, with Wes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll 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 I'll send him a message. He yeah. already, he already said he was comfortable uh with this going public on YouTube, but we'll double check just to make sure. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure like this. uh this is a you know open to the public stream, so I'm pretty sure everything he said would be he'd be happy. With being out yeah. in public. Yeah. But, uh... so, oh, like... cool. Uh, monochromatic stains. I just started mentioning. She's yeah. he's a friend of ours. He's a friend of ours also. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, don't he's, worry. The he's... the vod and highlights will be up here. He's a great guy. Uh, Stefan, do you want to take a I quick? Think so as well, whiskers. Like, two minutes or something. Yeah. To just change the on the call text to like. Oh. And yes. I need yes, to. I, I need that. to get some. He is what such else? a treasure. I love him so much. Oh, bless him. I need to. I need to. I need to get some cheese in celebration. Yeah. It's only gonna take a sec. We don't even have to go to like break screen. You can just edit it right here. Yeah, I'm just gonna. Oh. Uh, we can just do like. I did. Yeah. I'm gonna get some cheese. Uh, okay. It wasn't a joke. And break screen, tell us. In case we go Thanks, to the Mary. chatting window, I'll. I'll just go hey. here. Great stream, We're, fellas. I'm glad you liked it. We are gonna keep streaming for another hour and a half or so so we'll still be here yep yeah, um, um i think and then um, we'll be back on friday and saturday as well we'll probably continue uh skyrim i think uh, for our stream um i'm gonna take a quick like uh five minute break Wait. though i think or less than only five only if demon souls doesn't get here oh that's true yeah oh okay, if demon souls gets here then that's a different thing because so friday friday's uh the oh. pokey stream yes Oh, I wasn't Saturday. talking about Friday. I was talking about today. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, today, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what I meant. Yeah, All right. Today we're going to keep playing Skyrim. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Fine. Oh, I'll stick around bless. for you guys. All right. Um, Thank I'm gonna you. Take, um, just you guys. I'm going to take a quick break, chat, um, but I'll be right back. We'll be back in a couple. Oh, sorry. If I'd known that we were going to take a break, I would have left later. <laughs> Bye. No Bye. We'll be back. Hello. We're back. Hello. Gamers. Uh, okay, we're ah. ba we're back in Skyrim. I hope you had as much fun as we did because that was incredible. <laughs> yeah, always love hanging out with Wes. And, yeah, you know, obviously with the uh, with quarantine and stuff that's going on, we we cannot uh, mm -hmm. as much. So. so thank you for everyone this who tuned in and thing. followed and yeah. asked questions and participated today. We loved it. Yeah, uh, let's exactly actually let's hope, quickly uh, um.
I'm going to quickly just replay all of the uh, the follows from today just so we can thank everybody. Sweet, yeah, because it was a little hard to keep up. Because yeah. yeah. So I wanted to... First one we got today was... Riley Grace Ross Hong. Ross Hong. Thank Ross Hong. you. Uh, can, we, can I get that to play? Excuse me. Maybe I can't get it to play. I don't know why. I'm like pressing play and it's not doing it. Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, let's read so them off then. Them out. So thank you to... Riley Grace Rashong, Knowing Divine, Kitty Mama 42, V Vigo, Insane Pixels, X Terlina 27, My Fairy King, Gooblin, Gargar Finks. Thank you all so much. Yeah. Uh, we love we love the love and support we got today. Love to have you guys here. We love to we love to see it. Thank you. And if if Skyrim is a popularly demanded game we could do the occasional skyrim stream we wouldn't like make a series out of it or anything necessarily but sure. we would uh be willing to play skyrim again at some point I'm... unfortunately we probably would not be able to get west back for skyrim but maybe maybe, may, maybe someday but maybe one day maybe for the 10 year anniversary we'll see <laughs> maybe maybe yeah 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 uh we'll have to wait for that we have to find a dark elf to kill and harvest his blood so <laughs> uh can you get to soul slam yet we haven't been to soul slam yet no should we go to soul can slam? you go there i can go to soul slam yeah, soul stream. Go to, um, let's go to Windhelm. Oh, I'm gonna change our title now that Wes has. Wes is gone. Us. Yeah, so people don't think Wes is with us. They should make a Pokemon Skyrim where it's Pokemon, but in a Skyrim style open world. Yeah, I, I oh. agree. I mean, uh, my understanding is, I haven't played the Gen Eight games, but I understand they're oh, like partially fire. open world. I, it's my oh, yes, they are. Yeah, um, but maybe one day they'll have you know, fully open world where it's like several square miles of walkable stuff or like even like, you know, Breath of the Wild sized. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you play Breath of the Wild? Did you just... Like, I, do you don't, have I don't have a Switch, so I, um, I've only... I've only played it when I'm with people who have Switches <laughs> um, uh, offered to show it to me, so I've only played maybe like 15 minutes of it total, so... That's fair. I haven't played much of it either talking about breath of the wild i haven't played pokemon since like oh two since for all i know this already exists it kind of already does <laughs> uh but i, I still think it hasn't, hit its, it hasn't hit its fully fullest extent nazim you want me to kill nazim he's not a dark no, elf it, though no uh uh insane Skyrim in pokemon. Chat said, nazim i choose you oh in, oh i, 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 I got you pokemon. like the yeah. other way around where it's like you like you send out your your Pokemans, but they're Skyrim characters. Oh, where is this? Um, let's see, we have to go all this the way. Friendly to fellow. Born. I um, wish we, they would make Skyrim six oh, instead of Skyrim barely announced space RPG. I think they're working on both. He's asleep. If you're looking for passage to Solstheim, too bad. <laughs> Nazim has one move, and it's be indescribably condescending. <laughs> it's it's always yes. super. It always crits though. It's like one of those moves that always crits. Crits. crits? Yeah. Yep. Um, what happened? Why is it hard to explain? So, okay, we're gonna but find some dark elf. On board that, but uh, it's like, it's only normal type, so it doesn't do that much damage to a lot of types. Yeah. They were gone. That's not right. Losing whole days like that. There's been something strange. Sorry, I, I stepped out to get my water. What mission are we on now? We're doing a uh, dragon. We're board. going. So we're going to Solstheim A to oh. get some Dark Elf blood, and also because Wes will be there too. So, yes. uh, good suggestion, really? Calvin. Thank you. I'm not going back there. But of course. Um, but of course. I guess we're going to try to intimidate him. Hold on now. Okay. All right. Just that works. Hey, you got him. Never wanted to get mixed up in any of this. Can't you just pay him double the rate? Pay 500 gold? Yeah, but I, I'd rather not pay money and just... <laughs> tell him to like i'll push him into the windhelm docks if he doesn't take me so uh uh thank you f to the 16 people watching who are still watching uh it means a lot yeah. we love all of you uh look at this look at this cinematic i love dragonborn what a i remember when this this used to be like the most insane yeah. shit like it looked I never leave the boys. That's true, Abby. You don't. You love like, this used to be, like, the best visuals you got in a video game, like, in 2011 and 2012 yeah. when the DLC mm -hmm. came out. It was crazy. And thank you, Abby. It's it's so moddable, though. It still can hold up, you know? Yeah. yeah. 
Like, I, like least, I said, I'm, I'm waiting for the ray tracing mod. Yeah, I, I, I've, tracing I've modded mod. this game to its extent, you know, so. Um, I have a couple, I have a bunch of mods on my computer, but I, it can't handle the graphical mods, so I either need to uninstall them or wait till I get a bigger graphics card. State your intention. Yeah, you're going for the 3080, is it? That's what I want. <clears throat> yeah, this, it's impossible to get one right now. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. I want a, uh, I want the NVIDIA Founders Edition one too, which is like the hardest year because you can only get them from Best Buy. Because yeah. NVIDIA <laughs> stopped selling them from their own website. Right. Any questions? Uh... Chat, I... I... I, I've got a whole new batch of viewers to, to talk about this, too. People who've been here before are going to be like, yeah, okay, shut up, please. But uh, you guys get to hear this now as well. I, I, I got a PS5 pre-order. Uh, uh, and Show off. I, I have a, a confirmation, an order confirmation. Uh, and it says... It's supposed to get here tomorrow. It says arriving by November 12th, launch day, which is awesome. Mm. But it still hasn't given me a shipment tracking number, so I'm I'm getting a little nervous. Mm. I, that is that because is we really want to start a uh, Demon Souls remake playthrough on Saturday. It's mm. think, so fingers crossed. I'm a little monka s, but fingers crossed. <laughs> we're we're hopeful. Mild, mildly <laughs> monka s. I just looked. I just looked it up to see if it's a widespread thing. Like, oh yeah, a lot of people haven't been getting updates, but nothing came up, and it looked better. But that was just after like a, a ten second delivery Google driver needed for sustenance. You know, I, I, I can't blame the driver for that. I can't. It, it, I'll be it, sad. It kind of looks like an ice cream but, sandwich, you know? Like it, it, it do, <laughs> but like a reverse ice cream sandwich. Ice cream sandwich. Yeah. The ice cream's on the outside. Yeah. <laughs> This cheese is gonna be gone by the time this stream's over. I know. Um, Ali showed me this like meme of uh, there's this guy who ordered this air mattress, like it was like a hundred dollar air mattress on Amazon, while he was like mega stoned because he thought it looked like a giant ice cream sandwich. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, what am I doing? I, I touched right, to activate the earth stone. You don't do drugs, kids. <laughs> So you don't waste a hundred dollars on a non-edible <laughs> item. Look at look at me working in the emperor's clothes. Damn. I've never taken these off. These are uh, these are like holy now. You know, they've been blessed Crunchy by Wes. Ice cream. I wonder how long this has been now. Crunchy ice cream. Actress <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> Forbidden. I wonder if they're gonna make like a. Do I have to do anything? Oh, I just. There's a move. Oh, okay. You know, um, why the were so swaggy? Honestly, <laughs> they um. Oh god. So they're all things. Sure well, oh, well. they're, they're dark elves. They're probably used to this. It's kind of true. Oof. Oh wait, I recall. Oof. <laughs> it's a little uh, offensive. It too. hurts. The truth hurts. <laughs> I feel like Where's the I mean I, I I've played Morrowind so much like I, all, Dark Elves are just the craziest race in Skyrim or in Skyrim in Tamriel I'm like comes to it they're a little uh they're a little racist oh yeah well <laughs> more than a little aren't aren't most races in Tamriel a little racist yes I would say so they all bully the Argonians okay, that's true so they, what, they what, do, what do, what do, I do I go to Dunmer are super assholes, but I can't help loving them. Yes. Oh, same. same. And I mean, like, the Norse aren't exactly good to them. You ever been to a little city called Windhelm? Yeah. No, I've never heard of it. It's also crazy how, not to compare this game to The Witcher, because that happens all the time, but the cities <laughs> in The Witcher are so much more expansive. Hey, I mean, it's, it's the difference of, like... I mean, it's you know, four years. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's a it's big a, difference. It's a whole generation. It's of uh, video games too, if you think about it. Mm hmm Because it was, you know, PS3 compared to PS4. You know, whatever. This is Red Guard Erasure. <laughs> this is Red Guard Erasure. Completely unintentional. We assure you. 
Oh, there's a there's a doggo outside. Red guards are the least paid to race in Skyrim, which is so fucked up. Really? Yes. Yeah. Uh, I think um. I only I like I'm like I want to okay. single handedly like shift that statistic, so I only pick red guards now. <laughs> my first. My first ever Elder Scrolls character was a Red Guard in Morrowind. I went for like a warrior build. Mm -hmm. um, I actually found, I actually saved that first game to my Steam Cloud. And so I actually, when I set up this PC and I had Steam Cloud turned on, I actually found it after like, oh, it was nice. it was a save file from 2012. And it, oh made, me, it made me so happy to like find it again. Wow. Uh, but I, I looked at all like my major and minor skills, and it was something ridiculous. Like it made no sense. Like I had like I had like five weapon skills as my minor skills or something. Like I don't know why I went for that. I didn't know what I was doing. I still don't, so it's okay. Deadly. Oh yeah, they're all they're all over there. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna. Martin Ball. Do they just they resisted the uh, Viberjack? Oh no, they just. No way. Oh, these guys are tough. I was always a red yeah. guard warrior in Oblivion because I'm not good enough to do anything but melee. <laughs> yeah, no one gives a shit about the Thalmor. I feel you, Sean. My my big dumb brain don't work good, so, you know. Oh, I, I just always go back to the sneaky archer thing. Red guards have done nothing wrong, and everyone loves them. Except the Thalmor. Yeah. Well, you know what, Insane Pixels? Bring back Cyrus. The Thalmor don't yes. love anyone except themselves, so I, I think that's Yeah, the fair. Thalmor love high elves, and to a lesser degree, wood elves. Yeah. Uh, I've been meaning to play like Red Guard the you, game for. Did you a not think time. I was being serious? <laughs> Sorry, I, you guys can't see. Calvin's being very, very, uh, very negative about eating his cheese. He's very. <laughs> Stefan, are you going to do a Fallout New Vegas Let's Play? I could. If that's what the people it, demand. Um, it used to be out like here, by the way. Chat. You had to pick the one Fallout with no Wes Johnson in it. <laughs> Um, I, I just downloaded New Vegas for the first time. I played through, like, the intro quest. I don't think I've even left, left the first town yet. Um, I'm intrigued by it, though. It seems like a pretty cool, like, un, I, like, I'm intrigued by its unmodded state. It seems like it's, um, it's kind of everything I like in, like, an open world game already unmodded. So, I'm definitely, um, interested. Hello, this is your intrusive inner voice speaking. Is your stove on? Should I go uh, check? You know, it's really funny that you say that. Actually, yeah, it is because <laughs> a few weeks ago we did leave our stove on, but the flame I, I was not. I did too. Reeling gas into our house. Yeah, we were just leaking good old gas into our. I don't. House. I don't have a gas stove though. Well, that's a little safer. Besides, yeah. I don't feel comfortable leaving. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's okay. We're still alive, and the house is still standing. Yeah. No, I mean, it, it turned out okay. Really bad for we yeah. got Wendy's at like 11.30 or something, then we came back and we're like, it still smells like gas after we turned the stove off. That's yeah, really bad. So I think there's going to be a Dark yep. Elf corpse in this building, if I remember correctly. Uh, let's get a torch out. It's probably very dark. I'm sorry, chat. Um, it's okay, you're a bad streamer. I, I'm just such a bad streamer. Uh, oh, there, there's a body. Harvest blood. Also... Okay. It's funny that you say this is your intrusive inner voice speaking because I I, I have anxiety. <laughs> I remember the stone saga. Yes, yeah, we were we were uh, <laughs> lamenting to real life cousins. We were in a, a Discord call with our real life cousins at the time, and we were like, "What the f is happening? It smells really bad out here. It smells like gas." <laughs> Went and checked the stove. Oh, sure enough. Yeah, dude, me too, bro. Hey. But yeah, uh, Drucker, yeah. if you want me to, um, if you want me to play New Vegas, uh, I'd be happy to add more games to my Let's Play list of things I want to do. What do I have to do? Oh, that's where the gold is. I'm so sorry. Wes wanted us to pick up the gold, um, so there's we might have to go do that. But let's let's finish up the Hermes Mora thing first. Just give yourself a little poke in the thigh with the. Uh... Well, I mean, you do it for the main story. You like cut your hand so that the the Sky Heaven Temple opens. Yeah, please do. If there aren't any dark elf blood, you can make some. I know. I, I don't know why I can't just slice up. My hand slice yeah, up my yeah. Hand yeah. I've 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 uh, worked through it. It's helped a lot. It's great. So if anyone has any sort of mental health like issues, like anxiety, depression, intrusive thoughts, anything like that. First off, know that you're in good company. You're in great company here, yes. and we are <laughs> fantastic. Oh. 
Thank you. Oh. They put the accent on the F and the U so that you can get past the... Oh, my God. That was <laughs> impressive, actually. Wow. Know that you're in great company here and that... I do want to become famous. No, you're in great company here and that we will support you and love you and we will help you from our computer screen to yours. Yes. We will not be therapists. <laughs> I don't want to say that, but we will, like, you we're know... We're not very good at that. No, we're, I'm not we're, we're, we're we'll, like, you know, here, We'll just chill so. with you. And uh, we encourage anyone to seek help who needs it because it really does make a difference. So yeah, that's the PSA. I feel very strongly about this. Okay. I added it to our... We all do. Is, this is the single most satisfying animation in this game is this thing cracking open. Opening? Yes, yeah. absolutely. So let's all just like take a moment. Yeah. We're going to relax and we're going to watch this thing open. Yeah. Ugh. So I'm... Oh, I, so good. I'll get off my soapbox now while Stefan is having a moment. Yeah. <laughs> but um, I'll get off my soapbox. But yeah, like we we care about it a lot. So. Uh, yeah. I also love this. This always cracks me up. Yeah, it is. It's awesome. I love this part of the game. Vibe track. Oh, he's busy. Come on, it's not the it's not the thing you're looking for. What is this? It's it's just a book. It's just a book. See. Actually, I need to do something in my mind. Oh, do you? In Twitch, yes. Shut <laughs> Uh-oh, are you guys going to fight? Don't fight, please. Sibling fight! Sibling fight! Man. R.I.P. No Septimus. Violence. Yeah. Ogma Infinium. In my opinion, this is the single greatest stage of artifact. <laughs> Don't mind up. Don't That's your single Wesley favorite one? Yeah. Yeah. Don't let Wesley say it's not the Wobbajack. Well, hey, he voices Hermaeus Mora, too. It's true. He did be... He, I almost said he did became cocaine. He became... Look he did that. become cocaine. Oh, look at that. Come, my champion. Oh, his voice. I miss it already. Same. <laughs> now, you have my ugly yeah, and like... Craziest thing is, I didn't realize how much I missed him until I heard him talking, and I was like, "Wes." Yeah. Yeah. The last time I saw him in person was, uh, oh man, it was a while ago. It was a few months ago. It was over the summer, sometime. Um, we, uh, I, I was pulling into my driveway, and I, I, I parked my car like on the street in front of our house. So I pulled into my driveway and turned around to park in the street, and he was driving past. He <laughs> happened to be driving past at that exact second, and uh, we just talked for a minute. It was fun. That's great. That was the that was the last time I saw Wes in person. All but it's right, always goodbye, great Wes. to. Oh, there we go. Up. Let's look at all my perks now. <laughs> oh God! By the way, chat, the cheese is gone. <laughs> just the rind. Um, just the rind left. I put away a whole piece of um, cheese. Ark is not a huge cheese fan, so that was all me too. It's trash now, so I can do this. I'm tempted, oh, right. I'm tempted to do, like, alchemy or something. God in heaven, dude. I just, I... Alchemy? You don't even know me. Stop. <laughs> Poisoner? I hardly know her. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get, like, fine now. Oh my god. <laughs> Um, what should we do? I don't know. Should we do, uh... Pick one at random. Yeah, one-handed mad. Oh, you can't. Wait, yes, you can. Okay. Oh, I can. I think, uh... Um... Yeah, just, just being toxic. Yeah, let's just, let's, let's just get the poison. Oh, you just saw that, yeah. That's kind, of, that's kind of the vibe my character was going for for a little while. Yeah, uh, it's Ordinator. It's ordinator. Drucker. Yeah. Uh, that shit on the left is Mundus Ethereus in the Moons. Are you talking about... The, on the door? On... Well, what, what, what... Oh, left of what? In no, in Ogma. Well, he can't now because it's gone. Oh, oh. on Ogma? No, I, I have Ogma. You do? Oh, you haven't used it yet? No. Oh. Yeah, I oh, see that it. stuff. Um... I guess it's Ordinator. Do, uh, yes. Path of Shadow. Because, yeah. um... That's probably what's gonna level me up the most. Okay, yeah, I see it. It's cool, Diagram. Oh, yeah. Uh, just some info chat. I'm actually um. I'm applying to uh be a writer for the mod Beyond Skyrim. Oh, 
That's right. Yeah. So uh, we'll see how that goes. But it would be uh, the Atmora. I'd be writing for uh, Atmora. So possibly in the oh future. Oh my god, wait. They're doing Atmora? Yeah. Yeah, they're doing Atmora. So uh, some ancient human Nordic history. Oh uh, which my sounds god. right up my alley. Um, but uh, it would be uh, around about uh, that, that away. Uh, quite a ways across an ocean. But, uh... I didn't know they were doing Atmora. Oh, yeah. That's so cool. I love that. Oh, my God. I love that. I love that. Atmora sounds <laughs> awesome. Yeah. I. Yeah. Um, something not a lot of people know about me is that I'm really into, like, prehistoric. Can I say prehistoric history? I guess, like. Prehistory? Pre yeah, prehistory. Pre -history, right? Yeah. Like, I'm really oh. into, like, Neolithic, Paleolithic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stuff. I love that stuff. And, um,. At more it kind of ticks all the vi all the check boxes for me. Like it's got like ancient history, it's got cool fantasy location, it's got uh, incredible lore. Love it. Like ice age animals and stuff. Yes, I love ice age animals. I love cave art. Cool. I love um, like ancient like tools and like artwork and stuff like that. Um, honestly, I think after the Bronze Age, human history just gets a lot less interesting. <laughs> <laughs> If you ask it's me, a I lot love of history. Uh, it's a lot of history. I love the mystery of like ancient, ancient, ancient history, though. Like, I love like it's almost like a puzzle, you know. Like, you have like a painting. Of so, a so what, what you're saying like, is you, you what you're saying is you like the mystery of ancient history. Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying, Calvin. Just the movie Ice Age Thank over you. and over. Yeah, except I actually I was talking to my friends about this. I actually haven't seen Ice Age ever, like the movie. I've never seen. Ice Age is not that good a movie. It's fine. It's been such a long time since I've seen it. I don't even remember what happens, but I definitely saw it when I was a kid. Let's, uh, I've only... let's uh, let's get that. Um... You know what's crazy, by the way? Just speaking of of things that kids are into, um, I'm a, I'm a huge fucking boomer, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm so. twenty. I mean, uh, twenty four. Yeah, I'm twenty four. I'm a huge boomer, and I'm twenty. How um, so? Like, so, musically? like, I was I was teaching at a music camp, exclamation point, music, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was What's teaching at a music camp. Working on Beyond Sky? Oh, wait, wait, wait. That, was, that was two messages um, for me. Wait, uh, I can't, wait, I can't read, I can't read the first one now. Uh, can someone read the first one out to me? I'll, I'll read it after Calvin finishes. Okay, so yeah. Yeah, it, it's it's really not that important. But I was just saying that, like, I feel like such a boomer. Speaking of like things that, like, Ice Age and things that kids watch or like, because I was teaching these kids in a music camp, and they were all like, like talking about Fortnite and like Fortnite dancing. <laughs> and I was just like, oh my god, I don't know any of this. I just felt like such a boomer because yeah, I was like, y'all, I'm taught, only nine. I taught at a summer <laughs> camp, and I think I, I was only I was only eighteen at the time. <laughs> you know how many times they say Baby Shark in one verse of the song and how many verses of that song did i hear over that month-long period i don't want to think about how many times i heard the phrase baby shark um it doesn't get better as you get older i know sean Chat. i know i know i know I got know. Twenty thousand big ones Twenty thousand smackaroonies Twenty thousand oh. nizims the <laughs> okay. they don't like fortnite anymore so see first, i don't even know this the first oh question yeah first of all was What's the timeline for working on Beyond Skyrim? Um, I have to submit. I sent. I sent like a first writing sample to them, um, which actually I think that, that was uh, Drucker asking, right? Yeah. So Drucker, I sent them the first part of the uh, the fog story that I wrote, um, uh, and then they want me to send like an actual like in lore some dialogue, basically, and I have until I think the twenty fifth to submit it. Um, so I'm I'm on their Discord now, so I get like updates, and uh, I kind of know what. Don't do it. For, so don't do it until the twenty fourth. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's that's how it works. <laughs> um, By the way, uh, Stefan, could you like turn your microphone gain down? Like on the does your mic have a physical mic knob gain on it? I mean, or anything? It doesn't, but I can, I can do that on uh, Twitch Studio. Give me a second. Check. Yeah, it's just a little bit because you're you've been clipping a little bit. Ah, We're not okay. clipping peaking a little bit it's been like sort of like distorting um Give it a touch i, don't, I didn't i think sorry, it, I, muted myself. I think it's in discord not in dream oh yeah hang on one second give me a sec okay Are yeah because i think uh i seem pretty balanced on I, stream you know what in, in that case don't worry about it never mind that's fine 
Am I balanced? You sound fine to me. On stream? Okay. Hopefully. It's weird. Uh, okay, back to Skyrim then. Uh, and then the second question was something about Ice Age history. And it would be cool to see, like, Ice Age animals, I think. Which, yeah, no. I... Uh, I am so Sorry, sad. Yeah. I will. I will never get to see um, some of those amazing creatures. Um, but uh, who knows? Jurassic Park technology maybe one day will happen in my lifetime. So maybe I will get yeah. one day see a mammoth or something, which would be okay. really cool. Uh, do that we all? Do we all have favorite fine. Ice Age animals? Because um, I'm a big fan of um, giant Saber sloths. Saber tooth cat. Saber tooth. I have cool. thought about it. I didn't think about it until right now. Saber tooth cat. They're cool. That's true. Mayor, cool. Mayor wants to know when we can get a I Hardly Know Where joke compilation. Yeah, Sean's with you, Stefan. Okay. Also, sorry for uh, making the comment about the microphone. It's just Discord's being dumb. Okay. So as long okay. as we're on stream, I don't care. Cold-blooded cave goat? Cold-blooded cave goat. Excuse me? I've never heard of this. That's amazing. Um, I have a movie recommendation also, oh, chat. Oh, God. Did you look it up? Oh yeah. God! Is that the one with the front-facing eyes? Yes. <laughs> okay. Oh, I, I, I've weird. seen pictures of that thing. God. Um, there's that dude who is planning to rebreed mammoths in Siberia. You should read about it. He's nuts, but also fascinating. That sounds like you a thing you do, do if you lived in Siberia. If I'm being honest. True. <laughs> bring mammoth population back up. I don't know what to do. I guess we can go back to Solstheim. Well, I guess let's go to the Dawnstar Sanctuary. No. <laughs> yeah, that's the one. Hey. Um, I, but anyway, movie recommendation. Um, there's uh, one of my favorite movies of all time. It's called The Cave of Forgotten Dreams. If you're into like prehistory and like Ice Age stuff, um, it's about Chauvet Cave, which is um, this cave in France that was sealed by like a rock slide like thousands of years ago. And it, like, perfectly preserved. Um, there's, like, several cave bear skeletons inside. And there was, like, incredible, like, artwork on the wall. And it was only discovered in, like, 1994. And they basically sealed it up right after that. So it's, like, perfectly preserved. Um, and it's, like, Actually, really, really good documentary. And if you're into that kind of stuff, I highly recommend you check it out. That's pretty spooky. I don't know about, I don't know about that, Chief. No, I'm actually fine. <laughs> um, oh, Mark. <laughs> Mark is going to walmart.com to check the status of his PlayStation 5 order. Yes. Save it for later. I will check it out. Also, yes, I understand now after you said that, of course, because the planet is warming. Pleistocene Park. That's and a... the ocean is full of plastic. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I was doing it as uh, I could. Unfortunately, I already killed Cicero, chat. I, I, I can never make up my mind. I Usually, I don't. Well. Like oh really? I usually do because I like uh I like Ambjorn. <laughs> Still no update. Ambjorn? Yeah. yeah, that's her husband, right? Yeah. I don't understand why he looks like he's sixteen. She looks like she's like thirty-five or forty. Recent events notwithstanding. I maybe that, that's just their age. Yeah. That's despite your misfortunes, you stay true. Like, cause I, I, for a while I was like, oh yeah, she looks like she's you know. Not necessarily like a young woman, but like, you know, just like an adult, like a 30 something. Yeah. Maybe 40. And then Anvirin's just like, oh, I'm 65. Uh, maybe, he just has, like, maybe he just has like shaggy gray hair because he's a werewolf, though. Maybe. But like, Farkas and Vilkas have like black brown hair. True. And Iola has beautiful red hair. Uh, do we lie? Jeez, or do we tell the truth? What? No, tell him the truth. Always tell him the truth. I actually like him. I do like Nazir a lot. He's one of my favorites. Yeah, there are a lot of age gaps in Hollywood. That's true. Better face mod. I hardly know her. Yeah, I have some kind of face mod for this game, but it, bug it bugs me when it's like only it only changes the like female faces. Like I hate those kinds of mods. Yeah, I I don't mind like a graphical overhaul mod or yeah. not even graphical yeah. anime faces, but like just like the whole I need my waifu to look sexy. Like, come Smooth on, Smooth Woman. <laughs> oh God. Okay. Chloe Delvin Mallory, sir. You said it was nineteen thousand. I believe so. Well, all said and done. Oh, damn. Yeah, it I know. Oh, the, I need to Hello. 
Emperor Mom? Mom? Mother? Mother? Lies dead. You can you I forget, can you close the, the doors and be in there with her? <gasps> Enthuse Norseman, thank you for following Thanks us. For follow. Thank you. Oh no, you no. Just... I thought I, I couldn't remember if you could or not. Eclipse me out. Yeah. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for all the love you have been giving us. We yeah, yeah. it really encourages us to keep doing this because we're just a couple of or a, a trio of dipshits. We just like having fun. <laughs> Exclamation mark quote one. <laughs> Oh boy, you're a. Oh, you're oh, okay. Well, thank you for tuning late. in for as long as you did. Yeah, it's late. It's like. Oh. It's not super early here, so. Yeah, was it three in the morning there? Perhaps, uh, perhaps from Norway? Just guessing from your name? From your name? So <laughs> big. Yeah. And yeah, that's going to be late. Uh, good night. Yeah, yeah, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so on, much. Uh, Saturday. Yep, Norway. <laughs> He guessed. Just kidding. Yeah. I read your name. <laughs> yeah. It was too tricky. Bye bye. Thanks for tuning in. Cheers. There's no better face mod for the night, mother. You see, you ask that. There probably, there probably is. is. Probably honestly, uh, but like, nope. are you telling nope. me you honestly think you can improve on this face? Exactly. <laughs> I just like the the sheer quantity of like. Don't want to make a corpse look hot. I do, Alta. Come on, what's wrong with you? I just like chat, chat didn't like that one. I just like the sheer quantity. No, night mother pornography. I just read that. Jesus Christ, Rucker. Oh my god. I mean, just saying there were pornography. Um, chat is slowly ripping up the hornets. At least it's not like Bloodborne. Okay, you, you know. know what? We're not going to talk about that. We're not going to talk about that. <laughs> What's the penalty for necrophilia in Cyrodiil? Stop! Stop! Stefan! Stop! We we're not. We're not talking about we're it. We're not talking about it's. It's an oblivion. It's. It's from oblivion. Why? We're why is my vision like this? What the hell? It's. It's like you're a vampire and the sun is out, but it not is not going away. Yeah. What's. What's going on? My God. Also, imagine. Imagine watching or having a stream run at 60 FPS smoothly for the whole stream. Jeez. Oh. It, is that way when we play? I, I, I'm um, definitely not at 60 FPS though. I don't know what you're talking whatever. about. Whatever. You're uh, not. It's not choppy and dropping. All right, they're uh, I mean, they're fighting you. I don't know why my vision's like this. Hopefully it fixes. Uh, maybe. Yeah. What, try try like saving, quitting, and effects? rejoining or something. Yeah, I'll try. I'll try going into like the temple. There. Oh, there you go. That works. Um, uh, yeah, but yeah, like the stuff we're gonna be we're gonna be mostly playing. Um, what? Oh. Ultra Ness. Lame. We're going to be mostly playing for the foreseeable future on either Stefan's PC or the PlayStation 5. Yeah. So, lag shouldn't be an issue. Yeah. <laughs> I really think it's got to be the graphics card. Yeah. Maybe the processor huh. is, like, powerful as fuck. Yeah. And we use the processor to stream. It, it, um, oh. It, it's Do you know what I think? Card. Do you know what I think it is? I think it's my mod adding uh, watery eyes. Oh, hello. Because of the ash storm. <laughs> Why I'm, do you I'm, have I'm too, that? I'm too, I'm too immersive. I'm sorry, chat. I'm too immersive right now. He's just too. He's just too real. My yeah. eyes are too. Ash but yeah, I have. It, it, for storms. anyone who knows, if anyone can decipher this, um, just a power. If you can, if you can decipher this. Let me know confirm. the Calvin PC command. If anyone knows what any of that means, just let me know, and you and I are friends now. <laughs> <laughs> um, because if you understand that a 3900X should not be paired with a 1050, that's already like, oh, cool, you already know stuff. I'm not drunk, you are. <laughs> does Shadow, right, Mirror? Also... Shadow Mirror doesn't come on the boat, does, does she? I don't, I don't so. know. I just like Arvac. I don't have my horsey, do I? No. Okay. So yeah. Um, Gotta love bone mold. I I the, what's interesting is the processor that I bought the 3900X was formerly the second from the top. Um. Oh. Doesn't Shadow Mirror go have no idea. Idea. I don't actually know. Um, I don't know. Shadow Mirror doesn't go inside the caves and stuff. Yeah, I don't. But like, I don't have convenient um, horses. That might be the part of the issue. The processor that I have, the 3900X, used to be up until like four, like five days ago. It was the second best mainstream regular desktop processor that wasn't like a server grade thing for like 
running app like like multi-threaded tasks like upload like rendering videos and stuff like that and it's crazy like anything that's really computer intensive and not like not gaming not graphical intensive intensive that was like yeah, yeah. uh, uh I, I'm, I'm sorry i'm too immersive for you drucker <laughs> Ash Hopper. Oh, look at that. Look at that green blood. This is a 80s. I hardly know her. 80s Thank horror you. monster right here. Oops. I need to try it once. I need to not try it once. Never uh, been the soul stuff. Interesting. Oh. Have you actually not? Um, I actually only recently played the entirety of both DLCs You really don't. Uh, soul time, I really like. I really like the Dragonborn DLC. Dawn Guard was, I think, all right. Oh, it wasn't my favorite. I really like Dragonborn, though. I think it's a bit short, but that's, I mean, it's a DLC. Mm -hmm. Like, I think uh, Soul Slime as a world is really cool, though. I love exploring. Yeah. It. Soul Slime adds a nice, because it's not, it's not just the Skyrim Tundra Wasteland. Yeah. My uh, least favorite so thing about Dawn Guard right. is they just kind of crammed it into the corners of the map. And so you have to, like, yeah. you keep on having to go from, like, you know, south southeast of riften to like northwest. northwest of solitude and you're like god i will please. actually I, I will actually say that uh the forgotten veil is probably my favorite place in any video game that's true i do love the forgotten veil but I, that's just like the one i love the the falmer architecture and stuff like that but um maybe, oh my god that's very bad maybe i'm just do you like, know uh drucker do you know do, do you are you a, a computer person do you know things about computers or am i just going to say things that you're going to be like shut they're, up they're Kelly. a computer person i know i know from okay. experience that they, they know a fair amount about computers so. awesome so what uh <laughs> <laughs> what, what kind of what 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 are your system specs like generally oh thanks all touch Jesus. to it sam oh we got some we got some hoppy boys only because you said the word nerd yeah uh, yeah i'm sorry i'm like lagging a lot this is like this is not stream lag. This is actual like in-game lag because uh... it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Don't worry about it. Okay. Yeah, Grab your specs. Like... Yeah, I have a laptop. I have a laptop and desktop too. I built my desktop, and I obviously I bought my laptop. I can tell you my laptop specs because I'm a huge dweeb. <laughs> not all of them, most of them. Like I don't know what kind of motherboards in there. Or oh, I don't want damaged Magica. Oh, uh, whatever. Oh, we can um. <laughs> I forgot I have fire breath. Oh, that's a good that's a good shout. I like I have a scaling shouts mod. It like makes the game a little easier, I guess, but also like your shouts should get better as you get more because like eventually like fire breath, Yolto Shoal just becomes a waste of your shout because it doesn't yeah. really be anything. Um, and it takes so much time to uh cool down. On um the speech oh, tree and good. you have a whole branch for shouting. So you can level it up through your speech tree if you want to go for that um which here, is cool. just says, thank you for tuning in mary yeah we'll talk to you later <laughs> thank you you're gonna have a hangout sometime soon have a great night um i'm still heading the right way thanks i'm on the dell oem that was my old computer before i built this one so what you, what you got expand your air capacity Oh wait, sorry. That that wasn't even director. That was no, that was Jack. tips. I mean, yeah. If you want to tell me what you have too, I'd love to hear it. Alvin loves this stuff. I do. Like you guys don't understand. Anytime anyone's like, "Oh, I'm thinking about building a computer," I'm like, "Oh God, just let me help you pick parts." It's true. Uh, you did the same thing for me when I built this thing that I'm running it on right now. So wait, did I actually? Well, no. I as soon as I mentioned I was like building a computer, you're like specs. Tell me now. Oh yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> and. And you gave him a part. I did give yeah. him a part because yeah. I, I had a the thirty nine hundred X comes with a. Uh, I can uh, I can show it with all uh, on my camera. Oh I yeah 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 the, yeah. Uh, the internals. Yeah, so that lovely light up CPU cooler. It Look comes cute. with a uh, a like rhythm or a prism wraith cooler. Yes. I will. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, except at max only only Ooh. not max. That looks pretty good. Um, yeah, and it doesn't fit in my case because I have a little boy case. Like this I dream brought to you by yes. PC. I uh, I have a little ITX case. Oh, like, God. come on, come on. I don't think on. I don't think this, this area was meant for level seventeen boys. Um, and for, it's not a very big computer case. Um, so like, my the cooler that I got with my CPU was too big to fit in the case, and I was like, hey, Stefan, do you want 
this because it's better than yours and it lights up and he was like, hell yeah. Oh, wait. F's in chat. Oh, yeah. You died. Calvin, will you help me to spell the pure hate my mother has for Windows? Oh, Windows yeah. is Windows is a terrible operating system. <laughs> That's a no. Sounds like mom's not a gamer. Uh, Windows used Windows 10 used to be fantastic, and now it sucks. Hmm. It used to be like a super lightweight, easy to run, would run on a fucking potato uh, operating system, and now it just like my computer, my laptop runs anywhere between like 25 and 75 percent CPU utilization at any given point. And a lot of that has to do with shit that Windows just installs. And I'm like, why? And thank God this computer doesn't have to deal with that so much because the 3900X is like, <laughs> here, I'll use one of the, I'll use one of the 22 core threads you're not using right now. Okay. Well, oh, chat, we have, shit. um, we have half an hour left. I think soul slime is maybe a bit too hard for my character. Um, I, I want to ask, since we've done all the West Johnson quests on the mainland, does anybody have any suggestions for a 30 minute quest that they want to see me do? Or you can see me like fight a dragon or something. Y'all let me Jesus. know. Anything you want to see? I'll show you the ones I have. Dude, I, I hate the way I hate the way that Windows has dumbed down everything. Like they're trying to phase uh, out Stones control panel. Baron Zaya. Oh yeah, Stones of Baron Zaya. That's a half hour quest if oh, I yeah? ever heard one. Yeah. <laughs> but I just I hate the way that Windows is going. Um, because it used to be like very and it just it I, I getting rid of control panel is like a step in the wrong direction. I I don't know why they made it like um I guess like Windows eight they made it for like touchscreen. I, I I yeah they kind of kept they didn't they didn't go as hard in that as in Windows ten but they kind of kept a lot from that. <laughs> I, I kind of read it. Sam, so do you understand that the Stones of Baron Zaya is not a half hour request? <laughs> It's like close. the rest of your life, Chris. I did it once, with, but I did it I've... with a mod that told you where all the stones were. Oh, and yeah, you yeah. kidding me? I've never done it without. Even then, it still took me... I, like, I think I've only done it once legit, and I, I no clip to get to the actual crown the second time I did it, because I was like, I've done this once, I'm done. <laughs> but, like, it's, it's so like good. half an hour. Once you get it, though. It gets I so hit the nail. <laughs> yeah, I was pretty proud of that, to be honest. Yeah, it was good. It was a good joke. A half hour um, Chris to find the crown of Rolf, Do this whatever sanguine it's called. Which one? Sanguine. Sanguine? Yeah. Actually, I think uh, he's in... Um, he's in the Bannered Mare, I think. That's a fun one. Let's do that. Yeah, Jack, it's so fr it's so infuriating. I don't... I'm not, like... I, I don't... I'm not as good with the... Oh, my God, I'm... Oh, wow. I, you, have no, you have no idea how excited I just oh, got. Oh, boy. Here you go. <laughs> Exclamation mark, nerd. Please, someone. Okay, yeah. I'll let Alta take this one. 2060. Okay. Mm. Cool. Okay, guys. Okay. Can, um, do you want to put... Uh, okay. Calvin, can you put an uh, exclamation mark stuff on PC in chat? Too? I did. I can do another one for you. Oh, cool. Actually, if you already did it once, then no worries. Okay, cool. Since we're... Uh, since we're uh, Sam! Pulling, we're pulling out our, um, our rulers right now. I might as well. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I figured uh, a 2060, to be honest with you, uh should not be going with these things because of how old the other heart not that should not be but like compared to like don't listen to him okay compared to uh, the rest of the hardware also i win by the way chill i'm pulling out the rulers <laughs> um but yeah like the i7 4820k nice you have a case queue that's good um what kind of what kind of cpu cooler do you have that isn't working I couldn't quite see it if you said it. One down, my friend. One down. And another yeah. one for me. Should one sec. Okay, I feel like I enough. should be drink, drinking scotch right now or something. True. Go because you gotta sleep early for Rimsky. Have fun with Rimsky. We will. Thank you. Well, see you next time. Sam. Where are you registered? Oh my God. I think I We're almost done. If someone's car alarm yeah. going off. I'm one sorry. Yeah. So like you. you you have a Corsair Hydro. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Really all right. All right. All right. The staff is yours. And it, what part of it stopped working? You know, you're a fun person. To like, was it the pump or, or like, is it clogged up or something? We should head there. Hey, you don't 
so Sorry if you can hear the rain, by the way. Could be fun. I can't. Wake up. Also, real life father's PC has a. Uh, it's the pump that sucks. Real life father's PC has uh, an EVJ RTX 2060 KO Ultra, I so I can relate to that. So you don't remember fondling the oh, you have oh. like a fan control. That's pretty cool. TOS, TOS. Um, <laughs> what? Oh, uh, are there boogles? Yeah. yeah, the oh, Debella, yeah, whatever. Uh, I'm not going to persuade my way through this. We're going to go through the whole quest. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Um, hang on. And if we think you're sincere, we'll consider lending you. So, is the pump below, physically below where the radiator is positioned? Like, is the radiator above the pump? Calvin's coming up with a solution here. Oh, hey. Stefan, you still there? I'm still there. Wait, you're asking okay. me? Okay. Yeah, because I just didn't hear you talk for a minute, and I was like, sir? <laughs> um, okay. okay, well, no, the, if the pump is below the radiator, that's actually fine. Because the problem is when you have the air bubble, if the pump is above where the radiator is, if the pump is the highest point in a closed loop, air bubbles like there's going to be air in your cooler because that's just it's just how it's going to happen because it's just not perfect do y'all ever so like, listen to car talk few... i feel like this is like car talk but like for pcs and like yes absolutely it totally is <laughs> um let's host it <laughs> like if the sorry if i'm mansplaining to you just tell me to shut up if i am uh because i really don't mean to i just love like you don't understand how much i love talking about this mark is just mark knows he knows there's I no stopping know. me um but like if the pump is above the cp or above the the reservoir or you know reservoir the radiator then the air bubbles that are going to be in your loop are going to be up in the pump and it's not going to have good are you love hearing it great because cool, you know i love talking about it as i've said multiple <laughs> times you and i are going to be friends oh two peas in a pod here. you and i are going to yeah. be friends <laughs> And, um, yeah, so if there are air bubbles, like, on the, the cold plate that touches the IHS of the CPU, it can't get a good transfer of heat because either none of it or not all of it is being covered up, the water isn't touching it, you're going to let her die, aren't you? You just let Margaret die. No, I've already done that. Oh, you did? I thought yeah. I saw him walking up behind her with a knife. Oh, wait, what? Huh? Really? I thought I did. No, I've I've already done the whole Force Horn like oh, you, I, 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 okay, got, never I got mind. the note and everything already. Oh, okay, never surely, mind then. It's just funny. Surely, wait. So wait, yeah, wait. if if you have but if you have the pump below the radiator or below the highest point, cannot. Yeah, you cannot act ethically, Marker. I hate that quest Shout because of how it makes you. To no, I just saw the homeless man. Oh. Shout out to the oh, death oh, you see one Warcraft. homeless man and you think he has a knife and he's about to kill someone. All right. Hey, look. Roll in Online. Whatever his name is that says I die for my people and tries to kill Margaret, he's wearing basically that. <laughs> you cannot wearing act ethically right. in Markarth, wonderful city. I agree. Yeah, I no, really like Markarth. I, 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 I don't. I hate that quest because I don't like the decisions you have to make. It's so buggy, though. Um, it is. This only so is the Civil War. Yeah. yeah. The, yeah. Pump, the pump should be below so that the air bubbles are in the radiator. I've been trying to say that for like 10 minutes, but I keep getting distracted. Secondhand, thanks to Calvin and Mark for compiling life choices in such a way that led me to asking, getting to ask Wes Johnson Elder Scrolls 4 <laughs> questions. Still internally pogging. We all are, Jack. It's, uh, I guess, if anything, it was my life choice. Because yeah, it's true. I was the one who did high school theater. Mm. And, uh, and got to know Wes through it. Yeah, Wes is, is a big uh, supporter of Redacted High School's theater program. He absolutely and is. As he has, am I allowed to say he has children that went to Redacted High School? <laughs> now you are, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> because we don't, we don't know. We haven't said what high school. Is. Yeah. Uh, so and the, obviously being a, his children being a, such a renowned voice actor, obviously he got involved pretty heavily. So. Am I allowed to say the thing I just said? I, I just want to, I mean, I can edit that out if I ever, like, upload this, when I upload this. No. I don't know if we're, if we're uploading the whole thing or just the Wes Johnson part, but, um. Uh, I'd probably just make a highlight of the, the Wes stuff. Yeah. Um, Wait, are you allowed to say which thing you just said? No, it was a joke. It was oh, a joke. my bad. Oh, <laughs> yeah, 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 I got it. Stefan saying, 
Yeah, you and see, saying, my IQ is yeah. plummeting. <laughs> Plummet. You mean already plummeted? No, it's in the process of. That's why I can still speak. Uh oh, so uh oh. We're gonna fast travel to get just to get. Um, uh, I have what is back. known as a variable IQ. <laughs> I hope you're like li li liking the uh, the color gradient in the background of. Um, the stream. Oh yes, <laughs> uh, hard, hard one. Uh, yeah, the Force One dilemma is the closest Skyrim gets to moral dilemma. Speak to like that one question right around with the Alec here. Yeah, yeah the uh, those those are the two. Uh, uh, and they're both so yeah. My favorites. Drucker, we are sitting above our names. Yeah, Calvin's the, the blonde one, and Mark is the Mark's the the brown, darker hair. It's darker blonde, I guess. Mark has glasses. Calvin doesn't. Mark has glasses. Calvin does not. Yeah. yeah. Calvin wears contacts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Totally. And uh, wait, I have a question for you. This is very important. Do you think we sound alike? <laughs> we don't. Even... No, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't. Just, just let him oh, ask, okay. let them answer the question. Them, I believe, also. Jack, I, I don't like you. Didn't you say let them answer the question? <laughs> Uh, where is Shadowmere? Did I... Shadowmere just, like, not following me? I realized I, like, fast-traveled for the sole purpose of getting Shadowmere, and then I didn't even look around for Shadowmere. <laughs> so, yeah, do we sound alike? <laughs> Obviously, Stephon sounds different. Do I? It's a Force One conspiracy, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You sound similar, but not, not in the same Oh, my goodness. You were, like, one of the first people that's ever said that. Because <laughs> for some oh, reason... Can't tell us apart, <laughs> Lindsay. Oh, Lindsay. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Fucking are we the dude. same person? Oh my god, <laughs> um, Drucker! I love the picture you just. <laughs> Yo, if you just want to like, I, I, I'm, I'm not even joking. Like, if you just want to, if you, if you. I'm sure you don't need me to do this because you seem to know what you're talking about. But if you ever need, uh, want to bounce ideas about upgrading or anything off, like what you <laughs> might want to look into, whatever a price and stuff, perform press versus performance, you can always talk to me. Uh, just DM me on Discord. Come, come visit the brothers anytime. Yeah. yeah, any of you guys, if you're in our Discord, and you and you want PC help, just uh, message Calvin. Well. I mean, if you want to, if you're in your Discord and you want to contact any of us, feel free to DM us, and uh, we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Uh, anyone who's watching right now who has seen my Let's Play will know this shrine has some history. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> but yeah, specifically. I'm behind on a Let's Play. If you want, uh, I'm a bad brother and I haven't been watching it. I'll watch it. Oh, okay. it's, it's promise, episode one, so you don't have to. Uh, you don't have to watch very long. Throwback. We'll see. Then that's the opposite problem. It's been so long that you've seen it the first episode. Oh yeah. I'm it's okay, Drew. Oh, no yeah, worries. Me too. No worries. I haven't, up, I haven't uploaded in a little while, so you got you got some time to catch oh, up. Movie marathon. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Did you kill a man there? Did you? I did, yeah. Uh, Call yeah. of Duty, shoot a man. Shoot a man. Mama. <laughs> Just Ooh. shot a man because yeah, I, was, I was stealing from the shrine and some guy caught me and I killed him in cold blood. Oh yeah, of course you did. <laughs> Episode one. All right, Jack. You and me. Let's just be the most toxic commenters possible. And I'll be like the oh, one guy. Started. I'll be like the guy who's trying to moderate and be like, guys, come on, no, just give him a chance. <laughs> <laughs> Being mean to my brother right now. <laughs> Um, I like his map, by the way. Oh, and this is yeah, uh, the map is nice. It looks like a real map. Oh, this map. is Perth, Australia. I remember Perth, Australia. We've been meaning to visit him in. Uh... Well, hey, Perth. I don't know where you're going. We've been meaning to get back to him in the Let's Play, but we might as well do it in this one crossover, right? Did you ever get back at the Reach Guards for stealing your home? Um, no. I'm waiting to become more powerful, and then I might unleash the Force Sworn on them. That's what I'm thinking. Ooh, oh heck the yes! <laughs> There's a Sky Skyrim multiplayer mod. There's a Skyrim multiplayer mod. Yeah, there is. Yeah. Um, hey Drucker. You do it sometimes. I, I DM me, I, DM I me info great. about that, and we'll make it happen. Uh, I know. I've talked with uh, Tipsy about it before, um, so 
I think. Um, I don't. I don't think Mark and I can both play. You're joking. Right? Because we only have one game between the two well, of us. Killed, yeah. Yeah, and we would of course. Be... Hey, Shadow Mirror. Hey there, girl. Oh, what a good girl. God, the horses are terrifying. Can I just say, I finally got over my fear a little bit and touched a horse at Redacted Friend's house. But yikes. <laughs> Um, yeah. And of course, if you guys are uh, playing Skyrim multiplayer with us, we will have you in the call if you want to. Yes, yes. Uh, we love... Yeah, I know that they were developing this like mod for like the la the better part of a decade, and it's now like playable. Oh, oh, <laughs> we got hey. a dragon! We got a dragon! Am also, I gonna it's like... die? I hope not. If it's not a blood dragon, dragon, maybe. Though. Oh, true. I'm um, a jacket. Um, yeah, like I'm, I'm afraid of horses, but only like up close and in person. Like in concept, they're like beautiful, majestic creatures, and they're, they're really soft and sweet. But like, I'm just afraid because of how big they are. Creature? I kind of see them as uh, like these like forces of nature. You know, like I can't believe we've tamed them. You know, like that's that's remarkable ah. to me. What? What's? What not, oh God. Wait, well, uh, Jack, are you saying yes because they're terrifying? Because <laughs> they are pretty scary, but they're like, they're also really pretty. Look at that thunder in the distance. Oh my goodness. Uh, lightning. Can't see uh, thunder. Nah, <laughs> you say, yeah, like, nah, horses, horses are, like, great, but they're All also right. scary. It's a fire right. dragon, and I'm a dark elf, so I actually might be able to handle this. Are you messing with me, Drucker? I didn't know this. This can't be real. That's that's an amazing yeah. fact if that's true. Um, I don't. I'm gonna. You tweeted about it. What? Oh, look at us tanking that fire. This is fun. We're fighting a dragon on stream. Whoa. Uh, no way! This is not real. Listen, <laughs> he's joking, right? Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, he was joking. <laughs> he was joking. He said in a reply, "Okay, internet truth. I don't have a horse. The time it would take to properly care for a mini horse would just be too great." <laughs> that's that's a that's a damn shame. And then he and then he yeah no, lied there... again and said, "I do have a sloth." <laughs> there is a picture. <laughs> There is a picture, yeah. He he was he was he was trying to pull a fast one. Real fast one. I think he just googled miniature horse. <laughs> miniature horse and found that on his on the bad news like, oh it's perfect. He just did you see that dragon just like body slam into the ground? Yeah. Yeah. A bit of a hard landing. Uh, once they get once they get to half health, right they can't fly anymore. Let's see. Yeah. Ooh, do I um, and if they're flying, they crash, and if they're landing already, they just sort of make a hard landing. Alright, I need to get a this better resist fire up, I think. Shoot more tiny sticks at it. Yeah. They've almost got him, chat. Oh, look at that. He killed himself, I think. That dumb idiot. Oh, with the really, storm really and everything? Fun. Do you have any dragon mobs? Yeah, do you? I have deadly dragons, but um, I don't have any... It is insane pixels. Um. Yeah, it really is. It's it's super satisfying. Uh, yeah. The, um, I also have um Hunterborn, so I can like get dragon blood and stuff if I wanted to. Um, but yeah, I have uh, deadly Those dragons. Are first points. Those are yeah, basically my two dragon mods. Perks he has. Yes. Okay. Oh, that's a yellow. Let's go to. No, uh, we're right by Warkstead. That's a chunky. Ooh, was there once a hero named Ragnar the Red? Please, music me. Uh, oh. Should oh, I do a go. rendition of Rag uh, Ragnar the Red on my brand new Korg keyboard chat? Not, not today. There's Ragnar too much music. Ragnar the Red isn't even a good song. Oh. If we hit um, 100 followers, I'll do it. Yeah, how many followers did we get today? It was, what an exciting day. We got a lot of followers. We got a lot of followers today. Nerds. 
six or seven or something. Yeah. Two. Controversial take. Cold take. Six. Are you in Everstead? No, you're in Rorkstead. You yeah, I'm in Rorkstead, yeah. Uh, where's yeah. this? Oh, ten. Oh, yeah, okay, this guy. I remember now. I'm no I haven't done this quest in a while. We're now for Loke here! Okay, okay, okay. The reason Lokir of Rurik people like Ragnar the Red is because none of the bards know how to sing it. They all like, like none pause. of them sing it the same way. Oh, I, I, I guess yeah, you're right. And it doesn't. Oh. It there's no. It's weird. Also, Hadvar. Shout out to Hadvar. Uh, Lokir of Rurik said because he's the worst voice actor this game had. Ooh. Ooh. All seven of the VAs can't sing. <laughs> oh it's my not even god! That. It's just that they like don't know the tune. Anyway, it's okay. Wes can sing. Do you, do you see uh, this woman just like walking perpetually in the Yes, background? I do. This game, She's having a little... <laughs> this game is nine years old and it has some bugs. It's okay. See, when you talked about VA, I was like, the state in which I live or the monitor? And then I was like, oh, voice actor. Not, not a VA monitor, not Virginia. Voice actor. I want to get a VA monitor, but IPS was all I could get. I'm about to hit my 10k uh, sparkling water cans. Come on, this is fluctuating. It happens. <laughs> I, sh I I have accrued 20,000.2. 20, or 20.2 thousand. Uh, I've only got 6,000. I have this, like, gift thing that's yeah. been shaking the entire time I've been streaming. Uh, but I can't open it because my laptop has a broken trackpad. Oh, no. So I'd have to unplug my mouse and keyboard in order to, like, click on it. And it's just, it's not worth it. Where am I going? Drucker, I just I just keep looking up at the me listening to at real life Calvin talk about computers thing and it just makes me laugh. There's some kind of shrine up here. I have um... Also I love that too. That the the idea that they're canon because <laughs> Tamriel just be like that. It do be like that. It do be like God that. it is stoopy in here. It, it really I'm is. so hot. I cracked open a window. I I heard um, Coda. There's a lot of shrines in the area. Man. I heard uh, from a Canadian streamer that he said, this country makes no sense. It's like summer and it's November. And I was like, bro, it's not just your country. <laughs> okay, whose shrine is this? I have a Winter Sun installed, which is like a faith mod. So you can like, that's why I was able to worship Shea Goreth when we completed his quest. Yes, I noticed that. Yokudan Shrine. Oh. Okay, Call cool. it what it is. So if I was a red guard, I could worship there. Oh, Fan fiction. That's the giant. Sorry, I got really close and So I have to kill the giant? Well, I forget what I have to do here. Uh, you can just talk what to him. Find Gled of the Goat. I have not been paying attention to what you've been doing. I think he's just running around, vibing. I think I have to kill the uh, the giant. Oh, probably works. Rock it's going to send you into the stratosphere. The classic stealth archer approach. You know, Gleda, yeah, Gleda cannot die. She's essential. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, God. How are you not? Stop. I'm, I'm getting sick. <laughs> I'm not actually good. I got yeah, him in the again, arm. Again, 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 again. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Sucks, Sucks can't he can't make friends with the giants. I love the giants. Yeah, I think they kind of let me down a little bit with that. Um, uh, my favorite giants are the ones you find. They're mourning the uh, the dead mammoth in the yep. uh, the tundra there. Yeah, use use the wabba jack. Use the what? Insane pixels. Wow. What a <laughs> what a great idea. Am I all the way? I'm all the way back here by the dragon. Oh my god! I didn't quite save before that. Stefan, all right. You haven't even killed the dragon right, yet. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Uh, well, it, 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 it's 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 time to end this now. <laughs> anyway. Okay. <laughs> okay. Jesus. All right. I'm gonna. How long have we been alive? This gruntled Marwin. Two hours, twenty right minutes. Ugh. Yeah. Okay. Weirdo. We we we've been live for a good couple hours. I'm a little, yeah. I'm a little bummed that the uh, the rumors about. Him writing 36 lesson of physics on LSD is actually just a rumor and not actually true because what a what a cool backstory that would be. But um, don't yeah. do drugs, kids. Don't do drugs. Don't I make mean, it, don't make it sound like drugs are cool stuff. On. Drugs aren't cool. What are, what are you what am I talking about? What? But um, drinking is cool if you're of uh, uh, age and you're state, which I believe is 21 in all states in America. Should we raid 
lore father Vati Vidya playing Demon Souls? Uh, should we? We can do that. Uh, let's, we're in the chatting window right now. Um, I'll show yeah. everyone. I got uh, this keyboard now. Yeah. So we can yeah, have. Um... He's the only one that's. No one else is live. Ooh, I'm sorry. That's probably very loud. Uh, I'm thinking maybe at some point I'm going to do some laughs in Canadian. Anti Kirk, anti Kirk Bridey in action. I can support that. Um, oh wait, Pic Pixels, are you Canadian? That's I. I support that. <laughs> um, I think I want to do a like composition stream at some point where like, yeah. I in, I have like three hours to compose a piece. I've done this Thanks. before. In fact, um, I have another YouTube channel where I post my music stuff. I made a compilation of five pieces I wrote all within three hours. Not like nice. three hours for each. It's like fifteen hours total, but um, yeah. Uh, if you want chat, uh, that'd be a kind of fun thing, I think. So, yeah, I, I would personally love that as yeah. another streamer. I would love to be in on that. Not that I would compose, but you know. Yeah. Also, yes, insane, insane pixels. Um, Darmando twenty one. Thank, thank you for you, the follow. Thank you for watching us all the way from the the, the land of Canada. Oh, David. <laughs> hey, buddy. <laughs> uh, we got wow. we got follow. we got a Nexus mod link. Let's see what this is. Friendly giants. Wow. Hey. <laughs> oh, we got another follow. I just I didn't notice that. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, we're we're wrapping up here, but we are gonna edit the uh, West stuff yes. into a uh, highlight. So um, I'll send that to follow you our Discord. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, where we will post um, the YouTube links with West and everything as we post them. And where um, you'll see us, you know, we'll post information about our upcoming streams and everything. And um, I'll quickly do a uh, shout out my YouTube channel again. And I'll shout out uh, your or like our YouTube channel. Tipsy gifted a sub. Wow. Tipsy. Yeah. Oh, Comrade regret. Regret. The only two subs. Thank you so much for the gifted yeah. subs. And I wish that I could give my sub and that Comrade yeah, could give their sub to someone else. Oh because God. that is so unfortunate that the only two subs that have been given out <laughs> from me and Stefan. Uh, what are you talking about? That's our father. He's a mod. The second the time. The second time. Thank you so much for the gifted sub. That's so sweet. Oh, my God. <laughs> well... Uh, I think uh, it's been a lot of fun. I've had a great time. Uh, this was, yeah. I think, maybe my favorite stream ever. Just yeah, I think it's got to be. I think uh, I'm so happy. One of my yeah. We're doing a raid. We're, We're doing, doing a, raid. a raid. So yeah, so feel free to stay on, and um, you won't want to miss it. Loremaster Vidya is a god. Playing god. some demon souls. Also, look now we're switched. I'm Mark and he's Calvin. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, the gamer chair. It's fine. Well, goodbye everybody. It's been Bye. a blast. Good night. You have a great we'll night. We'll see you on Friday for Pokey Stream and Saturday. Hopefully, hopefully Demon, Demon Souls. Souls. Yes. If not, figure something out. Oh, and night, um, I uploaded uh, the first video in the Pokemon series on YouTube. So if you want to watch the first video, um, I haven't uploaded the whole thing yet, but it's like part part zero is what it is. So, yep. Good night. Good night, Bye. everyone. Thanks for stopping Bye. by. Bye.